All right, good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Creek Box TV. We're here. I'm here with my buddy, Tom Kennedy. Made it back from Michigan alive, son. Oh, yeah. Made it Man, all you got Michigan. new glasses. Yeah, I can, I can see. <laughs> Man, we're getting ready for some more exciting high school football, Tom. And we got Hebron Christian Lions are coming to Homerville tonight. Last year, me and you went, went up, up Thursday Atlanta. night. That's Man. Right. Oh. Took two days to get up there. Two days to get home. <laughs> yeah, two, two days to get home. <laughs> man, it didn't take but two hours to drive <laughs> yeah, from here to that's, Atlanta that's with right. you. Uh, but, man, the field, Coach Tyson and them, all the coaches, they've prepared all summer long. Y'all just uh, – we interviewed Coach Tyson before the game on Sports Talk. Uh, he done a great job. Uh, Hebron's been here. They got here about 4.30 today. So yeah. They're ready and for Alan, football I've heard – I don't know who it was telling me, but, you know, last year they've got a, an old pro football coach as their head coach. And I've heard they brought in a couple of his buddies oh, this year. Yeah. You know, um, I think that we're going to see a lot of just spread out and throwing the ball. That's right. Um, we're going to have to – the Panthers are going to have to defend the pass tonight, I, I think. Yeah, man, and, and like you say, they're going to be coached up. Uh, he played in the NFL for 20 years at yep. center for the Colts. So, uh, and he's a great fella. Coach Don talked to him uh, a couple of times here in the last couple of weeks. And, man, it's just great to be back in Homerville here at – Donald Tyson Field, man, yep. uh, uh, you know, was, uh, getting ready for some exciting football. And, uh, man, I've been looking forward. I couldn't be here for the pre preseason game, but, man, we've been looking forward to Creek Box for, <coughs> for a while now. It's just getting that time of the year. Miss Lisa's cooking for us. And, man, what man, a good Man, golly. <laughs> it was good. She <laughs> cooked some banana pudding, and I'm going to tell you something. And I'd you, fight somebody over that banana pudding. You have wore the springs off the door going in and well, out, man. Well, I didn't get just a lot. Get a to, well, just well, get the, one The play. first plate, I was trying to be nice and not get greedy. <laughs> And I came in here and took one bite, and it reminded me of my grandmama's <laughs> bold custard. Yeah, and I had, I man, too. I had to go back and get some more. <laughs> I, I, I need to give a shout out. I think my grandson Thatcher's been watching. He's Thatch. ready to watch us. It'll be his bedtime here in about 20 minutes. Yep. He goes to bed yep. uh, right at dark, but he gets up at dark. So, uh, yeah. Uh, but, man, uh, Tom, man, how was Michigan? You've been up there. Yeah, for we've a been up there picking months. blueberries, Alan. We um, finished up the season in Michigan. We started in April and. Florida and went through Georgia and all the way up to Michigan. So man, it's, it, I think the hottest it got was about 82 degrees. We were oh. up there for about a month. You've like um, died since you've come home then. You? <laughs> I got out of the truck. <laughs> yeah, I started sweating when I got out of the truck, man. Oh. <clears throat> then you just followed the season all the way yeah, on up. Yep, so, yep. Uh, Carried a blueberry picker up there. And a couple of local people went up there with me picking blueberries. We had a, had a good season. Man, the field looks great, Alan. It does, man. We got some parking new lots angles. are getting full, and a lot of people showing up. <clears throat> and uh, you, yeah, that's right. First home game, you always have a yep. big crowd, uh, Tom. And we got Tim on the sideline, but man, we're gonna go to a commercial break. Come back to me and you, and then we'll see what Tim's got to say on okay, the sideline. Okay, we'll be brother. back in thirty seconds. You're watching Back Road Sports on Creek Box TV. And then along came Walker Jones. Walker Jones is proud to welcome a new addition to the Walker Jones family of dealerships. Announcing Walker Jones Nissan. Nissan, innovation that excites. And you should expect the same great service at the newest home of the lifetime warranty. Lifetime. Now more than ever, we've got it all. So why shop anywhere else? Walker Jones Automotive Superstore. Now on both sides of Memorial Drive in Waycross. Get the best deal from All right, folks, welcome here to, to tonight's contest. Clinch County football is finally here. After the hot summer, after all the wait, it's finally arrived. We got teased a couple weeks ago with the scrimmage, but it's finally here. The new era starts. New coach Don Tyson kicks off his first, first game. Uh, he's part of the legacy. His daddy started back several years ago in the 70s. He's excited about it. He's ready. He's, he's uh, dreamed about this this whole year. Clinch County comes in as back-to-back -back defending state champions. We lost a great senior class last year, but we have some good returning players. We've got a lot of, lot of speed, a lot of skill, folks. If our linemen can uh, step up to the plate, it looks like it's going to be a good year for the Panthers. We're just excited about being here. Uh, the opponent, Hebron Christian, comes in off a 6-6 six and six season. Not real sure exactly what they have back, but they're coached by Jeff Saturday, longtime NFL player. And uh, they'll be well coached, as they always were. Last year, they scared the Panthers. Panthers had to pull out a tough fought 24-17 win up there above Atlanta at their home their home place. But it's here, folks. We're just so glad to be here. We're glad you joined us. Uh, get you something cool to drink, kick up, pick up your feet, and prop them up and get ready to watch. 
We'll be back here shortly with the kickoff. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu, including our famous grilled burgers, artisan-style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Winky's Southern Styles in Homerville is the go-to place for custom embroidery and vinyl transfer designs. Whether it's t-shirts, caps, or special Christmas items, Winky's will make it happen. Go by our location at 44 East Elna Street in Homerville and see Lenora for embroidery and vinyl transfer. Winky's Southern Styles supports the Panthers in their quest for another state championship. Go Panthers! Jerry J's Hog and Bones in Homerville is the restaurant for any time of day. Whether it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, or that special holiday meal. From pancakes to pulled pork and chicken salad to ribeye steak, Jerry J's Hog and Bones has the best food and service around. Oh yeah, and don't forget our great catering service. Go Panthers! Homerville Feed and Seed can provide nearly all of your farming related needs including seed, corn, bulk fertilizer, herbicides, insecticides, and a large variety of other farm products. Evelie and Nick want to remind you that you do not have to shop out of town to find the lowest prices. Our prices are as low or lower than any of those out of town companies. Come by and let the friendly staff at Homerville Feed and Seed help you select the farm products you need at the lowest prices around. Since 1972, Popeyes has been serving up mouth-watering, delicious, hot and mild fried chicken and chicken tenders from its Louisiana kitchen. You know about our great chicken, but have you tried our tasty seafood? All of our menu items come with a southern style all their own. On your way to or after the game, stop by Popeyes and remember we can handle all your special event catering needs. Conveniently located on Memorial Drive in Waycross, Popeyes puts a piece of Louisiana in every single meal. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. Camping World of Aldosta, located in Lake Park, is your one-stop destination for all your camping needs. Stop by to see your dreams of quality time with your family become a reality. Whether it's tailgating with your air-conditioned camper, taking a trip to the mountains or beach with your family, or driving your motorhome to a faraway destination, Camping World has it all. Let us put you and your family in a camper for as little as $99 per month. And remember, when you buy a camper from Camping World of Valdosta, you receive a free Elite Good Sam membership, roadside assistance, and travel assist for one year. All right, good evening. Welcome back to Creek Box TV. We are live here in Homerville. I'm Alan Handy with Tom Kendi and Tom. Fireworks going off. There it go. You can't see. Well, yeah, yeah you, you see a little bit. Right. Uh, man, we want to appreciate Jamie and uh, Bill Hendricks and uh, a lot of people. They donate money. If y'all want to be involved on that, y'all get a hold of Jamie, man. They go down there and get the fireworks. Uh, they do a good job with that. Boy, it is. When it's dark, now's when it's nice. Yeah, that's right. When it starts getting a little bit darker earlier. Oh, we got a Police is loud, and I think, Alan, I think that the, the, <clears throat> all the kids that went to, there they are, all the little girls out there. See oh, them? yeah, the kitty camp. Yep, kitty camp. I know to Ellen. Oh, Alden Langford's with her, spending the afternoon with us. Came to the ball game. They're all out there. Well, good. Had man. to get pom poms. Everybody ready? They're a lot cuter than those football players <laughs> oh, right yeah. there. Oh, yeah. Well, man, we got captains on the field. We got Ax Action Jackson, Jackson from Maynard. Yep. Number 56. Four <coughs> is Michael Walker. And number seven is DeLeo Carter. And, man, from behind, he looks like Tresman. He does. Man, DeLeo helped me in the blueberries this summer. He was walking behind that picker toting, carrying blueberry loads. He said, 
Man, I'm tired, Mr. Thomas. I said, man, <laughs> you better pick them blueberry lugs up. I see your better half out there. Yeah, the she's out there helping direct the little kids. It won't be make long. sure nobody gets that's run right. over by them big football yeah, players. That's right. Hey, uh, there's Eric Sat Harris on the sideline. Well, we're getting ready, man, from some more for some more high school football. Uh, we're gonna remind everybody this season. We'll, we, you know, you don't go to the Creek Box uh, <coughs> uh, app anymore. Let me pull this up because Daniel sent it to me, so I don't. There you go. Going through, led by the mascot, the Panther. I think we got a new mascot this year. Yeah, I seen where they just is. picked him up. Who is that, Tom? Do you know? Man, uh, Emily was telling me about it, but I don't remember who's what his name is. <coughs> we want to remind There's everybody uh, to remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for notifications regarding our live events. <laughs> YouTube and Creekbox.net is where you'll watch Creekbox TV this year. So we want you to subscribe. That way we can keep a count up. Me and Tom knows who's watching and where you at. And y'all be sure and hit a text to Tom. We got to get your number up there. Yeah. I have to get Daniel. Are we doing a texting creek box or texting me? I don't know. I'd That's rather text question. me. That's easier. <laughs> that way, I know if I got you saved, I know you. That's you know? right. That's right. I got most everybody saved to text in. I see where from Lex year to year. That's right. Lexi and Kennedy's watching over there with Thatcher. I think <clears> they were <throat> earlier. You reckon Coach Tyson's got a few butterflies? <laughs> What's he talking about? <laughs> I see Coach Dickerson. He's coming tonight. I is see he? Yeah. That's yeah, great, man. We got new uniforms, Tom. Yeah, I know. I was noticing that. New pants, new jerseys. Man, it's first year in several years. Thomas and Taylor's not our ball That's boys. That's right. But they do have their matching Sadie Hawkins shirts <laughs> on tonight. Oh, is it Sadie Hawkins? Sadie tomorrow? Hawkins tonight. Oh, is it tonight? It's tonight, yep. There's some faithful fans there from Hebron. Yeah, right? yes, sir. Made a long trip. We got any people up there watching? Y'all, please give us a shout. We'll put the number up on the screen right here in a little bit. So the Panthers get the ball first. He'll return it about the 15. He's cutting up good Come coverage on. by the lines. Back Great up the job. Looks like Down about the field. 30, 31. And that is Demetrius Rogers, number one, hustling down the field. That's going to bring the Panther offense out now. Brian Browning says roll red roll, roll from the Deep red South roll. Speedway crew. Over in Nashville getting the track ready. Got a big race tomorrow night. Man, they just race year round now. They, they do. Race it. all the time. All right, all the summer workouts, the scrimmages, practices, it's here. Panthers break here the Here we go. We got wing to the right. It's like and, uh, Hebron has 10 in the box. Panthers going to run that sweep. But they turn it over, and Hebron is going to get ball. a big turnover, Tom. That is number five on the recovery. That is Justin Peavy for Hebron. Good heads up. That ball rolled around there for what seemed like a minute and a half. And Tom, did he just Hebron, got his hand in there, I guess, I, I think it so just knocked it out of his hand, Alan. Oh, that's one way you don't want to start. Uh, no, uh-uh. Panthers did a great Let's job last week with no turnovers uh, in the yep. scrimmage. Uh, so here comes Hebron on offense now. And they will run the spread formation, and the Panthers will be in a 4-2. Coach Peterson, defensive coordinator, along with Coach Chase is the secondary coach. They're going to run a little draw right up the middle, and he'll pick up one, maybe two yards, Tom. Good defense in there by the Panthers. That big Craig, 99 in there, yep. 330. Uh, Hebron's got a good-looking front line, too. Number 78's a big fella. What's his number, name? 78, yeah, Zach he Gunderson. A, he's a junior. Man, and the other tackle ain't that small yeah. either. They have got some big kids also. All right, there they are, spreading out. Panthers staying a 4-2. Oh, and I uh, think they're going to come yep. motion. Hebron jumped. The Panthers almost did, but Hebron looks like number 16 yep. move for Hebron. Alex Paulson, he's a senior. Coach Tyson talked about that in the pregame on Sports Talk. You know, we had like seven or eight offside penalties here in the scrimmage. Yep. The, you know, the kids are jacked up. They're ready to fire off the ball, and it's hard not to, not to jump. <clears throat> but Hebron's going to do a lot of that tonight, I think, Tom. 
They come out there in a spread formation. They're going to drop back to pass. He's going to throw it down a good defense good out defense. there, Tom. Who was that? Number number five for clinch. That is Darian Simon. All right. Simon, not Simone. Not Simone. <laughs> he not corrected me all <laughs> summer on that. Yeah. I don't know if I've got his first name right, but I know his last name, Simon, not Simone. And that is Bale at quarterback for Hebron. Pretty pass, just great coverage out here by the Panthers. Yep. And he had a little bit of time to throw it there, Tom. Zach Robbins on the sideline, getting ready. He's wanting to kick. Was it third and 13, Tom? Spread formation. Panthers look like they're coming with a blitz. Pass, Bale drops back. He throws a slant. Good job by number 12, no, 15, that 15, 15 or 12. Great and job. And Trez Holden. Yeah, he got a hand on that, Tom, that actually broke it up. Home. So let's see what Hebron's going to do. If they, I don't know. I didn't watch him warming up, but they are going to try to kick a field goal, it looks like, Tom. That would be, it's on the what, the 28, 38. That would be a 41, There's old Sheikha yard. Robinson, election supervisor. She's been busy this week. Oh, that's right, man. Yeah. Everybody's qualifying City now. Council qualifying this week. I know they're going to punt, Tom. They're going to try to down it inside the 10, a high punt. It's going to fall. It hits at the 5, and he down. Uh, Did he get it? Nope, touchback. Man, that was almost a perfect play, was. Tom. The Panthers will good start high over. kick, Allen. He did Allen. They well, let's see. They're not walking out. It don't care. Okay, he's spotting okay. the ball at the twenty. All right, let the Panthers have a do-over. Yeah, that's that was a good play, save right there. That's you know, defense, defense come out stepped and done their up. Job. Good pass coverage and stopped Hebron. This young Panther line. This is a. They've been practicing all summer. They had a great scrimmage game here a couple weeks ago. They break the huddle. They got wing to the left. Hebron's got 10 in the box. We're going to try that. Uh, Moorhead running around the end. Great job by the defense. Looks not like, to let him get outside, Tom. Looks like he picked up two or three yards, Allen. Hebron That's has a... stacked the box on us. So, daring the Panthers to throw early here in the game. Have to break the huddle. <clears throat> 66. Who's that centering for the Panthers, Tom? 66 would be Dalton Murray. Doing a pretty good job. Panthers with the wing. They're going to run the counter back to the right. Good. He good makes one miss. Two, Two misses. Miss. There goes Walker. He cuts to the Three. middle of the field. One other one. That's oh, four. Four. That's going to be he's six. Off to the right. He better keep going. They're coming. No flag. What was that? About 85 yep, yards, Tom? 85 yards, Alan. Ball was on the 21. Man, great job, man. He, he there was half the team touched him. Yeah. Long run, good blocking in there. They were sitting on the sweep. Great play call in there by Coach Rance, Coach Tyson. Uh, we got them back to counter. <clears throat> it was from strong to weak, and uh, we called him asleep right there. And a great run by Walker. Yep. James Montgomery is the holder this year for. Looks like the, the holder for Robbins. <clears throat> and Robbins, he probably already has the record. Uh, just adding to it, he has made some kind of kicks in the last two years, and that one is right down the middle. So that'll make the score. Clinch County seven, Hebron nothing. So uh, we're working on getting Tom's number up there, yo. Be patient. There's a, you can see the Panthers have a big senior group this year. I need to give some more shout outs. I know mom and daddy's in DuPont watching. I'm sure Mr. Allen's at Eight Mile Steel with Miss BB watching. Uh, Mr. Wade, he don't ever miss a game. Uh, I'm sure Nanny's over there. Got Creek Box jacked up. So uh, we got a lot of people watching. Uh, quick, if we get the number up there, y'all shoot Tom a text and let us know where you're watching at. Hebron, uh, 
had an opportunity there. The Panthers fumbled on their first possession, actually their first offensive play, you know. Hebron started on the Panthers' own 20, but had to end up punting. And the Panthers took it two plays, about 88 yards. And that makes it seven to nothing. So, Coach Saturday coaching them up on the sideline. Finna have to create me a YouTube account, Al. Oh, yeah, Daniel <laughs> done hooked me all up that well, day. Just, yeah, give me on Allen's phone. <laughs> hey, Daniel, uh, he is the guru of computers, yep. brother. Lily James is watching from Athens. All right, Lily. They're fixing to have a lot of stuff to do here in the next couple of weeks. Yep. Georgia opens up, man. I asked her the other day. Ella's got a beauty pageant in McDonough the weekend of opening home opener in Athens. Uh -huh. And I asked Lily, I said, you want to come over to it? She said, um, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Robin's Live chat on Snap. Man, you can do all kinds of you. Yeah, I don't know how to do all that. That's a. Oh, Brian Browning saying, what's up, everyone? Lovely Ganey. Roll, red, roll. There's the kick. Robin's going to put it all the way down to about the three-yard line. Here comes 23 for Ebron. He's going to bring it out. Big hit for the Ooh. Panthers down there. Number 15, <clears throat> and that is Grant. No, I'm sorry. I'm looking for Panthers. Yeah, number I was looking. Here, I got yeah. it. Number 15? Yeah, man. He That's Antrez Holden. Man, what a lick. He hustled down the field. Man, I got all kinds of ways to communicate with people live chat. Matt Kimbrell's watching from St. Mary's. George right. Bassinets on Court Street. Yep, man. Granny is working. What he said. <laughs> Miss Martha Merritt Blaylock. Man, she watches every she game, Adam. Right. Doesn't miss a game. Kingsport, Tennessee. She doesn't. All right, Hebron runs play one, and they're going to pick up maybe a yard, might be two. Good defense in there by the Panthers. Darius <clears> Dorsey <throat> on the stop. You see the chain game. Oh, over Johnny there. Gilbert. And, and uh, that's uh, Jason Mayer. If in. Yeah, Shops is oh, over Shops there. Oh, Shops over wiping his head. He says, <laughs> hot out It's here. hot. They are in a, it's not a spread formation. At, or what you call that, Tom? I don't know what the coaches are doing over there, calling the signals. They dance doing two step. Panthers will stay in a 4 2. They woke up a corner. They're going to bring a blitz. Hand it off, trying to get outside. Great defense in there by Panthers. Great job. That's number 15 again, Tom Heath. Made. Yeah, we've called him. Oh, Andres Holden. He, he we've called his name a lot, Alan. He's a senior. Doing a great job. <clears throat> oh, Leslie Bateson. Shout out to Leslie Bateson. He's watching from home. Got his old feet propped up. Watching Creek Box. With that AC running high. All right, a good draw. Oh, good good run. run. First down for Hebron. Big play. Panthers were, they went no huddle there, Tom. Yep. They caught, kind of caught the Panthers off guard. Mr. Kenny Shirley's watching. Thomas Flowers is watching from Perry, Georgia. All right, man. This old Tomcat, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Here comes the run and play again. He's going to pick up three, four. So he brought him trying to find something to work right at the Panthers. Here comes Austin Peterson and big Craig in the game. Austin's picked up some weight this summer, too. Yeah, man. They're going hurry Quick up. snap. Good job in there, there's big By Craig. Number 99, big Craig Harris get, got through there. Yes, sir. And he takes up a lot of room when he comes through that line, Alan. He will knock the air out of you when he tackles you. I guarantee it. Good job by Craig, and he's just a junior. 99, so that's going to bring up what? Third? Mm, third and one? No, or the second th one? Well, they must have had a penalty no, there, Tom. Yep. Third and one because I thought he lost yards. Apparently uh, had some kind of penalty there, so it's third and about half a yard. They're going to run the jet quarterback. I'll keep it, Austin. Oh, I believe he got line. it. Yeah, Alan. he got it. They had him behind the line. Austin Peterson and number 13 for the Panthers. Up there on the tackle. 
First and 10, now at two first downs for Hebron. They huddled this time. Seems like they had more success when they go no huddle, Tom. He drops back, he's looking, he's gonna throw a little out. Ooh, good catch. Good catch. Man, if he doesn't lose his feet, Tom, that's a touchdown. That would have been a touchdown, that would have been a six. Great job out there, that's number five. That's Bell, number four, at quarterback, throws it to Peavy, number five. So Hebron's trying to answer the Panthers here. Halfway through the first, Clinch County seven, Hebron nothing. Taking their time now, letting them get set. Hebron's going to run a little jet to the left, trying to get outside, nowhere to go. Good job by the Panthers. All that started with number six coming up there, Tom, for the Panthers. Yep. That's Grady, I think. Yeah, number six is Markavius Grady. They said he picked up a yard, maybe a yard and a half. Second down. Hebron has crossed the 50 now. Trying to answer the Panthers here. All right, if y'all want to do shout outs and stuff, go to YouTube, go to our Creek Box YouTube channel. Sign into YouTube and do a shout out. We'll try to do the shout outs off of off the YouTube snap or chat, whatever it's called. <laughs> go talk to us on YouTube is what I'm trying to there get out. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> right, Daniel? All right. I have to get Daniel to write it down and, and, yeah. and read it. <laughs> we got to thank Brad, Mr. Berrien, uh, all them there out here. Do, uh, they're outside. It's hot. Yeah, where it's hot. It's, it's yeah. hot. Yeah. Berrien's been here since 8 o'clock this morning setting up. So uh, Third down, big play, and the Panthers are going to take it. Interception. Interception. He could take that He's to the gone, house, Alan. Tom. Oh. Who is that, number 10? Let's see right here. That is number, number 10. 10, Perry Williams. And he just, he was sitting there. He just set him up, Tom. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that referee was trying. Yeah, he, he was trying to run down the field. He wasn't gonna keep up with. <laughs> he Barry. wasn't. He was giving it his good effort though. So that makes it 13 to nothing now. Panthers a pick six. Both teams with a turnover now. But the Panthers were able to stop theirs. Stop Hebron on their turnover. And you know they had put up a good little drive there. The Lions did. Don drank a Tina Lacey from Dre Snack Shack. He's out there watching, yep. flipping some wings, I imagine. Oh, man, he's wanting to know when we're going to want some wings. Maybe not tonight, but next home game, bring us some wings. That's right, man. I like those Cajun Ranch wings. Miss <laughs> hey. Lisa's filled me up on banana pudding tonight. Yeah, she put – there's no leftovers, man. We eat it all. Well, if there is, I'm going to take him home. <laughs> oh, it bounced right, Robbins. Oh, it kind of, I don't know what happened there. The low snap, he couldn't get the ball down, so Robbins didn't even get to get his toe on it, Tom. All right, Adam, well, that's, uh, we're going to take a short break. The Panthers up 13 to nothing. We'll be back in 20 seconds. You're watching Creek Box TV. Is Jesus Christ your steering wheel? or your spare tire. Sadly, for many, it's a spare tire. We go through life not worrying about the consequences to our actions until we get into a bind, and then we call on Jesus to bail us out. For others who accept him as their Lord and Savior, he is their steering wheel. They realize as they walk through life, he'll be with them step by step, guiding them to their final destination, heaven and eternal life. Which one is it for you? At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll, 912-490-7142. All right, Tom, we're back here live at yep. Creek Box here at 
Uh, Donald Tyson Field, Panthers are up 14 to nothing over Hebron Christian Academy out of Atlanta. Oh, Tommy Foster's watching. He's on. Um, All the way to the end not, zone. Good kick by Robbins. So they have to bring it out on 20, Tom. What's it called? YouTube? Yeah, YouTube. Yeah. Watching from YouTube. Lovely Ganey. That's a good shot. Devon McCaskey. Uh, that's Barry yeah. up getting a shot of the coaches up top. Yep. Got some hard working Ooh. coaches. Some Joey coaches. and Blake. I don't know who that was on the other uh, end. I couldn't tell either. Oh, man. They had a penalty, so Robbins is going to have to do whatever he had a touchback. Probably offsides there, Tom. Yep. Well, this is one of our new <coughs> shots here. Man, they need to paint the goalpost. Yeah, they need painting. So the Panthers are getting ready to kick off again. Oh, KJ and crew watching in Canyon Lake, Texas. Canyon Lake, Texas. Yep. Right, right around the block. Oh, Bryce Lee's watching. He's been up there in Michigan with me. Man, I mean, he's ready to get home, wasn't he? Yeah, he, ooh, he was ready to get. He had old girlfriend <laughs> waiting on him at home. He was ready to get to the house. All right, here goes Ryan. Man, what a kick. Another one. Down to the, about the eight, yeah, yeah, eight or nine yard line. He's gonna bring it out. That's number 23 for Hebron. Good return there. Panthers hustle down the field, and that would be Jaden Stowers for Hebron. Oh, Jet and Lily K. Turner said roll red roll. All right, man. We got a few people watching tonight. Yeah, there's a bunch of people watching. Alan Johnson's up in Atlanta. He's watching. Man, and that's why we want him to sign in. Yep. On YouTube, that way we can uh, send them a message. Yep. Live chat on YouTube. There's 203 people right now. Man, that is great. All right, here come the Panthers. Oh, the mother, that was a turnover. Tom, I was wondering the Panthers okay. had the ball again. So another turnover, back-to-back -back turnovers. Pick six and then a fumble on the kickoff. Fake the counter this time. Moorhead's going to throw Ooh, wide, wide open. Over, just to overthrew him a little bit, Alan. And, man, when you're 6'7 and get <clears> overthrown. <throat> <laughs> oh, just a Moore, bit high. Moorhead had him wide open and just, you know, it's first game. Yep. We'll come back to that, I'm sure. Coach Ramps will write that down, check it off. Man, the new jerseys do look good, Alan. The new pants. Panthers stay in that wing. Wing to the right. Jeremiah's in tight. Oh, and we're going to have illegal procedure on the Panthers. Number three moved early for the Panthers. That'll back them up five. Alan Jackson Borden's watching from Brooklyn, New York. Brooklyn, New York, eating pizza. Derek Haley's watching from New Jersey. Man, we got a big crowd. Yeah. I like it. Ben Coker's watching from Rome, Georgia. Rome, Georgia. Oh, that ain't the real Rome. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> I don't think they're in the Coliseum. <laughs> uh, all right, Panthers without right, power here we go. sweep. Moed trying to get outside. He's stiff on. That's going to be a, a flag on the play. I believe I, so, Alan. Number five there, Justin Peavy. Let's see if they call it on Moorhead or Hebron. Call, gonna call it on Hebron. I uh, see. Most of the time, that's who the call's on. Oh, White Cap looks hot, doesn't he? He is, and it is gonna be on yep. Hebron, Tom. He's a good referee. He referees a lot of games over here in Clinch County. See, Coach Tyson coming out, so we'll take it. We're like, that, that's 15, isn't it? Yes, sir. <laughs> 15. The Panthers. Oh, Coach Tadpole. <clears throat> Tyrone Carter, man, he does the kids love him. No, Tom, it was a five-yard penalty. Was it? No, 10, because it was second and 15. Yeah. That means it's second and five now. Antonio Jefferson watching from Seattle. Man. And Angela watching from Montana. Go Panthers. All right. Lex Hanley's watching. Go Big Red. I yes, believe you sir. know her. Yeah, man. Here come the Panthers. They're going to break right. the huddle. Heron's got everybody stacked up in the box. All 11 within five yards. Panthers wing to the right. We're going to run the counter back to the left. 
One man had him behind the line, number three for Ebron. That was Burke. Good job, he bounces off of him. Harold Wayne and Dones watching from Fargo Highway. All right, Harold Wayne, Dones, man. I got to send some prayers out. Uh, he filled in for you last year, old uh, Josh Lee. Yeah. He had little bitty kind of surgery this morning. He's home recovering. So, uh, <laughs> just small, just very just small, little small procedure. Little small procedure. <laughs> so that goes. They tried to run that blast. The Panthers do great defense. Oh, and uh, 75's helmet comes off. That is uh, P. John, boy. That's old uh, Drake. Drake. So he'll have to come out for a play. Josh, well, if I'm you not, listen, buddy, text in to us. Yeah, trying to get. I've called him a couple <clears throat> times to check on him today, so. He might still be out a little bit. All right, fourth and five. Coach Tyson said we're up four, 13. So he's going to pull the trigger here. Actually, it's about a fourth and six for the Panthers. Jamar Jones, roll red roll from Sacramento, California. All right, man. Danny Shaw. Josh Lee says he's going to get us. Oh, Tommy. Oh, man, it up, that was almost. Knocked it down. He brought Bozer back. So Josh is watching. He's yeah, Josh is watching. Clock. He is. He said, "Bring him some banana pudding." Man, there ain't gonna be no banana pudding. No left banana. There. If there's any left, it's going <laughs> to my house. So that was a great defensive series for Hebron. Yep. Well, Big Rob and Monique from Shiloh. Man, I like this. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to work. What is it now. again? It's not Snapchat. YouTube. YouTube. <clears throat> Hebron needs to get a drive. Samuel Irwin here. watching from Buford, Georgia. Big Buford. They need to make a drive here, Tom. It's going to be a pass, it looks like. Bell, they come back out in a spread formation. Trying to get the Panthers to jump. Good job being disciplined in there now. Yeah, they know it's coming now. Yep. <clears throat> Bale looks over the defense. Barking his signals. He better call it. I don't know. I think do we have a delay of game, and I think we do, Tom. That's on the coaches there. Uh, Bale was ready to snap it 15 seconds ago. Yep. Man, that yeah, they just moved the ball. I think that was a five-yard penalty. Was. They moved it about eight or nine. And that's on your first down, and you hate to do that. Whitecaps coming over to talk to the sideline referee. I th he's the referee on the Panther sideline. I don't know what they're talking about. I guess he keeps the clock, the one over here on the sideline. So they waved it off. So that's what the discussion was about. The Whitecap, I guess, thought it had been a delay a game, but the referee keeping the clock said, no, no, I didn't tell you it was a delay. So that's called a wreck part do-over. Hmm. All right. So we'll line them up and go again. I know uh, Hebron's coach is excited about that. He didn't want it to be first in 15, 16 yards. Man, it's been a long first quarter, Tom, it seems like. That's a big old coach. <clears throat> all right, they're standing up. They're all huge. There comes a snap. He's looking just a little Ooh. turnaround pass play there, and it's in and out of his hands. He's trying to get it number 16. That's Alex Paulson, senior for Hebron. So it's going to be second and 10 for the Lions. Lions trying to get cranked up here on offense. They need a yep. score. Tell you what, that Zach that Gunderson, number 78, he is a big kid, Tom. You right. Yeah. He's 6'5. <clears throat> Having to call offsides on the I guess they did. It's illegal procedure against the line, so that's gonna be first and fifteen. Stays first down, it does. So that was that play didn't exist there. 
Oh, let me catch up here. Charlie Jacobs is watching. Darlene Carter. Bennett Waters. It comes with the draw up the middle. Good, Good defense play in by there. defense. That's 70. 71 and number eight, I oh. believe. 71 is Tyler Posley and eight is Ty Jump. Who's that? Who number who? Number eight. Number eight is Carzell Thrower. No, it's not. Isn't that number eight? That's number nine. Oh. Twan. Tajon Gordon. Yeah. Yeah, Tajon Gordon. Twan Gordon, something like that. Gordon. That's Gordon. Gordon. That's Gordon. <laughs> <laughs> we'll fi I'll find out the Monday at practice. You can believe that. There comes another draw. Another Good. big defensive play. Great tackle in there, Tom. That's number, well, number 16. 16. We've called his name, and that's ta – there it is, Tavion Sowell. Great play in there for the Panthers. They're backing up. Now it's third and – man, halfway to Argyle to get a first down here. 2.30 to go in the first quarter. Panther is controlling the game offensively and defensively. Big Rob says Connor and Alex says roll red roll. Allen King Jr. is watching from North Plainfield, New Jersey. All right, man. We got a bunch of people bunch up there. All north. over the place. There's a tunnel screen. He's coming Ooh, across block. the middle. Great run in there. The Panthers mm. finally wrap up. Tommy's going to pick up 10 yards, but it's still going to be fourth and 12. Fourth and 12, Allen. Great play in there. Just made people miss. The Panthers were setting back. Good job out of secondary there. Ooh, yeah. late block A little there. bit of a late block. So it's fourth down for the Lions now. Great job by the Panther defense. Oh, Corey, him and his son, Colby. Colby Davis watching from Lake Park. All right, man. Bonnie and Bappy's watching from Fargo, Georgia. Big city. The Honorable Mayor and First Lady. Yeah, man. Fargo, Georgia. There's the snap. Going to get the punt off. It's a high punt. Come off the side of his foot. Oh, not that good, Tom. It's about midfield. And as they change right, sides. Well, they'll take we we swapping to, sides. We want to go to Tim right now or maybe when we come back in a minute. I'm looking at Daniel. What We, we going to Tim? Yeah. All right. All right, All right Boogie, come All right, on. Come on, Tim. Give him a countdown. He doesn't know it yet, Alan. Four, three. three. Here we come. Two. Come Boogie. on, don't, don't mess up counting. Come on. All right, folks, here we are. About halfway through the first quarter, Clinch holding the 13 to nothing lead. Couple big plays. 79 yard run by Michael Walker to get us on the board, and then a about a 65 yard interception return for a touchdown. Um, Hebron's trying to slow the game down a little bit. And don't want us to have the ball. They're trying to milk the clock as much as they can. Looks like we may have uh, one of our linemen getting his ankle wrapped. Other than that, I think everybody else is pretty well in good shape. All right, we're going back to y'all. All right, Coach Carroll, we appreciate him being on the sideline, man. It's That's hot what, out there, it's too. It's hot. It's hot. A lot cooler than it was a couple of weeks ago, though. I can tell you this. If Mr. Barry wants to get a bigger trailer, I'm <laughs> telling him we don't need anything bigger. They're all going to want to come in here with us if that's we right. get anything bigger. That's right. Max capacity right now. There's, There's Mr. Barry. Man behind the scenes right here. <laughs> Puts it all together for us. Pretty good cameraman. Yep. Yeah, I, we'll take him. <laughs> All right, here come the Panthers. Wing to the left. We're going to run right up the right middle. Up the middle stay. That's Grady, number six, six. I think, yep. Tom. Markavius Grady. He picked up an extra six or seven yeah, yards just it. by, you know, staying on his feet. Young offensive line there for the Panthers doing a good job making holes. <clears throat> you take away that first turnover, and that's about the only thing. At least the defense thing. held them. Yeah. I mean, it didn't. Panthers are threatening again. They're down there on the lines, 35, trying to get the first quarter over with. There's the snap up the middle again. They hit him at the line. He bounces off one. Dorsey makes two or three more miss. He'll lean forward. He'll pick up six yards, tough yards up the middle there for Darius Dorsey. 
hard hits in there. He keeps driving in big thighs. 24 seconds. Let's see if we get a playoff. Great coming back in the game for the Panthers. And we're gonna have to tell them at halftime to get some shots of our of our fans. Yeah, Brad is gonna start getting it back up. There comes a snap. We're gonna hit him up the middle again. Dorsey again. He'll lean forward and get a first down. And Tom, that's gonna be gonna the end of it. the first quarter. Panthers up 13 to nothing. All right, Adam, we'll take a 30 second break. We'll be right back. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas has the cheapest prices in South Georgia and a huge inventory of new and used gas and electric golf carts and off-road vehicles. Mike's also has parts and accessories and proudly serves customers across the states of Georgia, Florida, and Alabama. Whether you stop into our store or shop with us online, we have everything you need for Can-Am, EasyGo, Club Car, and Yamaha. 0% financing available for qualified customers. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas, Georgia. All right, folks, we got the first quarter in the books. Clinch holding the 13 to nothing lead. Uh, driving on the ball, ball on about the 25 yard line for Hebron Christian. Clinch trying to go in. Condition is starting to kick in now. It's hot. Um, Clinch has been de been very disciplined on defense. They watched the film against New, Hamp New Hampstead and in the scrimmage, we jumped offside several times. And Hebron's trying with a hard count to draw us off. And so far, we've been disciplined enough to stay onside. Uh, Clinch is uh, starting to pound the ball inside. We went wide early on. Now we're starting to pound it up the middle. Clinch tr trying to extend this lead to 20 to nothing here to start the second quarter. All right, Tom. And we got local legend Tresman Marshall watching from Big UGA. Tres. Nolan Smith, Tresman, and Kobe Dean watching. All right, man. Y'all boys stay out of trouble up there in Athens. I know. want to wish him good luck with <clears> the yep. Bulldogs up there. I hope he gets to play a lot, man. I tell you, he's a chiseled young man. I yes, yes, he is. I had a video of him here the other day on uh, Facebook yeah. at practice. Yep. Laying the hammer down. Here come the Panthers, wing to the right. Moorhead's going to back up. He's Number looking 11. over there to no, – Nope, right, he's going to tuck goes. and run. <laughs> we were looking at the receiver. That shows you just how quick Moorhead is yep. and the Panthers at the three-yard line. Uh, we're looking, and everybody in the stadium thought he was going to Jeremiah, number 11, and uh, – Moore had seen the safety come across, and he took the ball and run the opposite way. Great heads-up play. Well, we got a lot of people cheering from for Hebron on here. We got Dana Frazier, Derek Haley, All right, Grover man. to meter, Laura Pack. Man, lots of lots of people watching tonight. Well, that is great. Here comes Grady up the middle for the Panthers. He's going to try to bounce it outside, lean forward, got, touchdown. Yep, got in there, Allen. See what Coach Tice is going to do oh, here if he's going to kick it or go for two. Man, it's getting cold in here. No, start it. <laughs> uh-uh. Cut that air down. No, in a sir. <laughs> Zach's still in there. All right, he's excited. Yeah, yeah. He didn't get the kick. All right, let me see. I'll catch it. 19 and nothing. Let's see if Robbins can – there's, There's Bo, Bo Gator. Gator. Shot of the crowd. Yep. Panther band. Kevin Allen, Brooke, Mitchell King. Shot of the band. There. Man, looks like the players. fans are full. Eric Thomas. There's Big Walt. Big Walt. There's Jamie, Jamie, There's Hendrick, Jamie so. Hendrick. Look at Jamie. Got barbecue sauce on his shirt. All over his shirt up there. There's the kick. That up is good. good. All right, Allen. That's going to put the Panthers up 20 to nothing on Hebron. All right, we'll take an 18-second break. We'll be right back. Come out to Lolita's for the best cold treats and hot sweets around. You'll be glad you did. Located on Highway 84 East in Homerville, Lolita invites everyone to enjoy our outdoor seating, our New Orleans-style snowballs, and fresh mouth-watering beignets. Don't forget our tasty chili dogs. For your convenience, Lolita's is open Monday through Saturday from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Come cool off or heat up at Lolita's, East Highway 84 in Homerville. Homerville Jewelers on East Dame Avenue is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. 
you're looking for that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby, look no further. We also have a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches and necklaces and can perform jewelry repair. No need to shop out of town, we can supply all of your gift and jewelry needs. Let Vicki Young and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. All right, Tom did a good shot of the fateful. Come all the way down from Atlanta, <coughs> from Hebron. Man, we appreciate him coming to South Georgia. <laughs> that guy right there in the middle, he's hot. Man. He came prepared. They're down here in South Georgia, he's hot now. A lot more humid down yep, here. Yeah, it is. You can see, man, we got, a, man, all the people man, running we gonna the have to get We're going to have to get the flag, I mean, the, the goal post painted. That's right. You need to, I'm going to have to get with Don on that. They probably haven't been painted in. 15, oh, no, if they were painted, they'd stand and with our cameras like they are now, you can really see them, you know? That's right. I think we can make that happen. Man, we see the concession workers down there. They do a good, every one of them people donate their time and effort. Man, y'all go to concession down there and hook up, get you a hot dog, hamburger. You got the band booster on one side and the football team on the other. Y'all go down there and support the Panthers. There's another high kick by Robbins. It's going to come down about the 10. Hebron's going to bring it up the middle. He's trying to bounce it outside. Good coverage in there by number 26 for the Panthers. And that is, let me look right there. That is Moten. That's Shane a, Moten. That's uh, the hamburger man. And boy, he's making a good hamburger. Yep. And, hey, man, Mr. Johnny and Emily Griffiths from Fargo are watching. All right, man. Man, and the... The whole Griffiths group down there is watching. Probably, probably um, Lanier and Kelly may be watching. But man, we wanna wanna send our prayers out to their family. Mr. Johnny's been sick lately. That's we right. wanna wanna lift him up in our prayers. He's a good man, always has been, and means a lot to to the community as a whole. That's and their family exactly does right. a lot for everybody, and um, just want the family to know that everybody's been praying for him. Hope Mr. Johnny's gonna gonna start feeling better soon. We sure hope so. All right, Hebron's going to run it up the middle, Tom. They pick up about six yards, so a good first down carry in there. Lions trying to get on the board, drilling 20 to nothing here. They're going to keep it on the ground. Number four for the Panthers comes up, makes a big hit, and that is Walker coming up from safety. <clears throat> so that's going to bring up. Let's see, did they give it to him? No, it's first down. He's going to pick up a first down. He runs, go and hurry up. Try to get him up the middle again. Good job in there by number seven for the Panthers. And that is Carter. There's the EMT. Oh, Lee Lane. Hold on, I hope to keep, let me keep get my camera out. Oh, Lee Lane's famous. Yep. And we, <laughs> <laughs> Nick. There's Coach the Dixon right Coach here. Dixon. Yep. He put his coach's <laughs> shirt on so he could get in free. <laughs> and he thought Man, he was a uh, coach at the game. Yeah, the EMTs always do a good <laughs> job of getting in. And... Hey. Second oh, 11 lane. for Hebron. They stay in that spread. Bale's looking. He's going to throw put a little out. Put some good pack. pressure on him too, Alan. He did. Finally getting a little bit. Second, they're doing a great job making him hold the ball a little bit longer. And there's a shot of the crowd, Tom. Yeah, there they go. There's the Hendrixes and there's Ryan Daniels and and let's see. There's there's a, the Keith Hendricks and Janessa. Oh, okay. There's a old Linwood Rowan, Shane Miller. There's Here, help me Carla. out. Help me out. There's Laurie. I, I just Laurie. saw M. Lynn, Alden and Ella up top right there. There's Jason Bell up there. Here comes the long pass. Ooh. Bell throwing whoa, down the whoa, field. Whoa. Got him. Did he come back and get no, it? it? No, it oh. hit the ground first, Alan. And that was a great uh, offensive play. He kind of pushed off on him and got away with one, Tom. Just underthrew him just a hair, man. They needed that. That's going to bring up fourth and 11. There's, There's pretty, pretty cheerleaders. cheerleaders. Man. And Old Panther's hot right there. He's taking his hat off. Liza's. Isn't that Liza sitting down right there? <laughs> she looks hot, too. You can see the bleachers are full. Here yep. tonight opening. I think they were gonna they had done a student section in the bleachers tonight. That is good, man. That's yep. great. 
And we want y'all to stick around here at halftime. We got a new band director, man. Uh, they're going to put on a good show for you. Y'all stick around and watch the band. So they'll get to go a little bit longer tonight. Hebron, does, their band didn't travel tonight. It was such a yep. long distance. Another punt. This one a little good bit better, Tom. Good Alan. Oh, and oh, he touched it. No, he better get he, on it. He didn't touch it. He touched it. He throws it down, and let's see what he's going to say. No, he didn't nope. touch it. Man, that was close. He almost touched it. Oh, Danny Ellis is watching from Palm Coast. All right, Danny. We appreciate Jacob you. Jacob Porter, Elizabeth Hunter, Colin, Colin Cavanaugh. Cartman, go lines. Hank Haddock, Derek Haley, Yasmin Gordon. These people aren't from Clinch County. Man, we don't care where they're nope, from. Nope, glad they're watching. Oh, Dana Frazier is watching from Auburn, Georgia. Auburn, go Tigers. Josh Lee, he's out in DuPont. He's from Clinch Big County. city of DuPont. Big I'm city. sure he's sitting on the couch propped up. Nope. Got old frozen, got frozen bag of peas yeah, out, I probably cooking you. in the night. And Tom, I don't know. I guess the penalty was on Hebron. They're backing them up. Ten more yards. That's going to put them down all the way down to their own nine-yard line. No, that's the Panthers. If uh, penalty's on the Panthers, it's back them up to their nine. This must have been a holding call or clip. There's a picture there of leaders. Oh, Katie. Katie's hey, right Katie. here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, Frankie Tex, they just got back from the Texas Roadhouse. He said he's full as a tick. Ain't gonna be now he's got him a cold bottle of water kicked back on the couch. All he's doing is waiting on Miss Patsy to bring him a bowl of ice cream, and he will be out. Yep, he ain't going to make it. Nope. Let's see. We got a time. Hebron's got a timeout, Tom. That'll give you time to catch up on you. Yeah. Shout Let's out see. for I, a second. I did a minute ago. We got old Keith Edmond. He's watching Elizabeth Hunter, Jacob Porter, Cindy Corbett. All right. She's watching on the big screen in the air conditioning. I guarantee you. She, she can, at home in the air conditioning, she can throw stuff at Matt there. Yeah. Position Matt just in the right spot. She can just reach over there and just <laughs> knock him out. <laughs> it be Greg Smith yep. on the chain game tonight. Yep. He's back in action. They counting down for something, baby. What we doing? Going to boogie. Got there he is. Here part way through the second quarter, clinched with another score. Uh, quarterback Tyler Moorhead broke contained, got down to the five, and then Grady ran it in for the five yard score. Clint still looks like they're grinding out pretty well in control. Uh, penalty, careless penalty on the punt to back this up down inside our ten. But uh, overall, good good showing so far for the Panthers. Back to y'all. All right, Boogie, we appreciate you keeping us up to date on the yep. sidelines, man. Uh, Tom, one thing, I, nobody has gotten injured so far tonight. No, so that's just, I uh, hadn't seen anybody cramping. We're not on the field. There's the there's cheerleaders. The cheerleaders. Back out. Ooh, slow down. Brad, there's a Karasu on the end right there. I did get that one. Yep. All right, Panthers try to run off tackle on the left side. Hebron's going to. Him more head up after a couple yards. Oh, Rick Moss, something's in Aspen, Virginia. Cardavius, Cleveland. There's, there's the, the student section. There, yep, there's the student section. Yeah, I there's the old Taylor right there. Yeah. On. What they got the Hawaiian stuff on? The yeah, that was from old Danny Strickland. <laughs> yeah. He's checking everything. He's trying not to look right there. <laughs> yeah, I guarantee you. <laughs> Second seven for the Panthers. They're gonna run right up the middle. Good job by Hebron. Panthers might have got one. Frank, you say what happens tomorrow night on ESPN at seven? Man, the Gators are playing college football. Kicks off with the best team. Always first game. <laughs> always the most exciting team. So, uh, uh -huh. I'm sure Josh would agree with me and Frank. Yeah. <laughs> That's about it, though. <laughs> Tom, it looks like we got one down now. You just 70. had to say something, didn't you? Yeah. Just had to say him. something. And that is Zach Gunderson. So maybe he's just got a cramp, man. Alan, who was the 
last year. You remember that short kid? I should maybe shouldn't call him. Call him the, the little fella that played for Hebron that was so quick and fast. I know who you're talking about. I forget. I hadn't his name. seen him. I, somebody just was texted he a me. Senior? Last he might have been a senior. Yeah, he was a good athlete. Yeah. He was a blur. There's Craig and P. John on the sideline. Big Craig Gaines. Talking about the price of Coca-Cola, I'm sure. I guarantee it. That was a good shot. Panthers on the sideline. Man, the crowd, they, I'm telling you, there's Man, nobody left As hot as town. it is, yeah. it's a big crowd. Tom, maybe it's that just That might a be a little bit more than, well, no, there he goes. Yeah, he's going to get up, and he is a big kid. He'll make it to the sideline. Coaches come out. Trainers. That's Coach Saturday with the headset on there in his hand. Luana Maddox, Bonnie, and Henry Moreland. All right. Coach Moreland. Good shot of the fans. And look in, look in. Yeah, there they all are. Man Coach, wood. there's the coach's family section right here where they all sit. Yeah. Jim there's standing Ella. on the sideline. Alden, Ellie Grace. Good shot of the Panthers. Crowd, third and six for the Panthers. All right, Panthers stay in the wing. They got the wing to the left, but they got it arced a little bit. Stretched out, trying to get him out of the box. Good job by Hebron, but he keeps fighting for it. Driving, and man, he's going to be close. They had him behind the line, and just great running in there by Moorhead, driving them big thighs and keep yep. fighting for yards. Oh, Lee Lane, a.k.a. Daryl, he said he's listening to us on Will Joyce's Creek Box. All right. Down man. there on the sideline, so they're watching, and they're watching it on the phone. <laughs> There's a little bit of delay. That way, if they miss it on the field, they can look down that's real right. quick, you know. We do that on purpose. Yeah, that's right. For Just for the Yeah, Coach, Coach Pope. Pope. Come on, give us a smile, Coach. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> he tried not to. Hey. No mean mugging walking <laughs> yeah, by, you know. that's right. So this will be the first punt tonight for the Panthers, Tom. Bring oh. Robbins on the punt. Ooh, he'll get it off. Oh, Shirley and Eddie Teston are watching. Don McCoy says Shirley hadn't figured out the chat thing yet, so <laughs> Don had to send a text in for. Shirley and Fast Eddie. T. Puckett, Michelle Newell, Lovely Ganey. Everybody's watching. Man, we got a big crowd tonight yep. watching. It's good finally to get the season underway. We got something to do on Friday night. Yeah, that's right. Every Friday from here on out, you can catch us here on Creek Box. You go to YouTube, man, and sign in so we can uh, send you a message. I'll try to have me a YouTube. I'll get Ella to set me up a YouTube yeah, account. That's, that's what I do with Lexi. She does all my <clears throat> yeah. Lexi or Daniel. If them two can't do it, it can't, <laughs> it be, can't done. be done. That's right. All right, Hebron trying to get on the board here before halftime, Tom. There's seven and a half to go in the second quarter, and they need a touchdown. They can score right here. It might can give them a little bit of momentum. Panthers are staying in a 4-2, and they it call looks a like timeout. Tom. All right, yeah, I think they did call a timeout, so we'll, um, we'll be back in about 37 seconds. Lutz, Brown, Pegler, and Manley Insurance Agency is locally owned and has been a part of the Homerville, Clinch County community for many years. We make it a priority to know our clients on a personal basis and take pride in customizing insurance coverage for the particular needs of each customer. We offer all lines of insurance including auto, home, business, life insurance, annuities, and bonds. Lutz, Brown, Pegler, and Manley Insurance Agency, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Go Panthers! You know, one of the devil's favorite tools is to tell us we have plenty of time. Like, uh, one day I'll get straight with God whenever I'm a little older, or, or I got some cleaning up to do before I even think about going to church. But the Bible tells us in James chapter 4 that we're not promised tomorrow. And in 2 Corinthians, today is the day of salvation. Don't wait. Come to Jesus today just as you are. 
You're watching Backroad Sports on Creekbox TV. All right, welcome back to Creekbox TV. We're in a timeout here in the second quarter. The Clinch County Panthers 20, Hebron Christian zero. Academy 0, Tom. You know, you take away the pick six, though. Uh, uh, you know, it's about even. Hebron's had one good drive, got down to about the 20 of the Panthers and turned it over. Yeah. They just need something yeah, good to happen here. Yep. Seven minutes and 36 seconds left in the second quarter. Well, oh, that is a big coach over there for Hebron. That right is. There, isn't he? Lord. Tell you what, if something breaks out, you yeah. take care of him, that, I'll be behind you. That's exactly right. They're going to try to run off tackle on the Panther, Panthers, and good job by the Panther defense. That's number four, Michael Walker, coming up, making the stop. Panthers right now just went into the line of scrimmage on offense and defense. It's going to bring up a second down and nine for Hebron. Oh, Cartman. Great broadcast. Go Lions. All right. We appreciate Man, we appreciate it. We've got over 300 people on uh, watching, and I think all of Clinch County is here. So yeah, that's good. A lot of people from out of town watching. We appreciate everybody tuning in. There goes Bales and shows his a little bit of speed, Tommy. Man, lower the shoulder and just great run in there for Hebron. Pick up some yards. So uh, they had some pressure coming, and he stepped up in the pocket and picked up about seven yards. They're going to come back and run off that left tackle. They're going to get a first oh. down this time. Good Got hard to lock running. up. That's number one for Hebron. He is Rogers. Demetrius Rogers, good looking athlete too. First and 10. Hebron come now, they're on the Panther side of the field. They're keeping everybody in. I think they're trying to keep everybody in the pass block, just running two receiver route. It looks like he's just gonna throw that one away. Incomplete. Bring up second and ten for Hebron now. That'll stop the clock. Six oh eight to go in the second. Panthers up twenty to nothing. Kick off the twenty nineteen season. Coach Tyson's first official game. That's right. Game. That's right. Comes the handoff, they're going to try to get it up the middle. Good job by the defense. Darius Dorsey, uh, Moorhead coming up from safety, and that was number two, Ethan Burroughs on the carry. And he had nowhere to go. He went off tackle. There was nothing there. He tried to bounce it, and nothing there. Great defense. Coach Peterson, Coach Chase do a great job on that side of the ball. Third five, and ten. Over five minutes left to go. And his second, uh, his second quarter's just dragging by. Alan. He drops back. He's going to throw Good a little pass. out. And that is, Tom, you can't. Good pass. There's no defense for that. That's Donovan Moore on the reception for Hebron. Great pass route there. He just threw it, got rid of it, and he runs under the ball. Moore did. And first down. Third and ten, you run a 12-yard 12, 12 route. Yep. Hebron trying to get on the board here. Up the middle, number two again, and that's Burroughs. And he's going to drive for about a three, maybe a four-yard gain in there. No, it might be five, six, almost seven yards. Good hard running in there. They're hurrying up, going no huddle. Oh, 78. Uh, they'll snap it. Trying to catch the Panthers off. That is Hodges, 78. That's 330 pounds. I think Coach Peterson got a timeout here, Tom. Yeah. All right, Adam, if they're going to take – well, let's see. Well, let's say they finish show this. There it is. There they are. are. The student section. We can give them all yep. a shout-out. Wife. <laughs> no, Thomas is holding up the wife. Bless. There's, There's the Jamie. Hey, Judd. There's Touchton. Yep. Big Get walk. Good picture. 
There's Coach Moreland getting up. There's Manak. And that's Moore from Mainer. And we got a good crowd of Panther fans. Man, a great crowd. Look around. There's Kara's uh, son. Around, you Raymond see so Strickland. many people, and you yeah. see all of them you know, and you try to say a name, and you're looking at somebody else. Raymond and Lenore. Yep. There's Miss Katie. There's Big there's, Eric Harris. There's, there's. <laughs> Is that Trent with you? Yes, Coach Hatton. I don't know Trent from behind with a hat on. <laughs> he don't have a brace or his yeah, arm. Yeah, that's sling. right. Where's his cane at? <laughs> There's a shot of yeah. Hebron side. <laughs> oh, girl right here in the white shirt, she's not yeah. happy. Well, they left probably, Tom, about yeah. 9, yeah. 10 o'clock yeah. this morning. Stopped and eat, I'm sure, around Macon. We did that last year. Luckily, me and you went up we the night We went up before. night ahead. Yeah. We got to stop, eat a good steak, and slip in the next day. Four fifty-seven to go in Second quarter, it's second three for Hebron. Trying to get on the board here before half. They're going to run it right up the middle. He got maybe a yard. Good defense in there by the Panthers. This is four down territory, no matter what. <clears throat> They're going no huddle. Snap, he's going to run it up the middle again, number eight. He tried to bounce it outside. He's going to be close. He might have it. Number eight is Winston Gazet for Hebron, and it will. It'll move the chains. First and 10 from the 21 now. And the Panther defense is playing a great game tonight, Alan. Yeah, they've been on the field. Yeah, they Man, have. they're going no huddle now, and Hebron's kind of. <clears throat> And it's hot, Tom. Bell looks over. There's our There's cheerleaders. The Panther cheerleaders. Panthers bringing pressure. Bell's going to hand it off. He's trying to get outside. Good, Good job in there. Defense really, Tom. The corner made that play and turned yep. him inside. Look right here at the bottom of your screen. He Just fights like off the block. Yeah, that's textbook. Great job. And there's that number 10. And a good solid leak by number seven. Yeah, that number was seven. number 10. Uh, Carter's number DeLille. seven. DeLille Carter. Coach Chase will be excited about the secondary. They're playing well tonight so far. <clears throat> Second and 10, all that action. He got back to the line of scrimmage. Oh, Frankie Ashby's cheering on number 28 in the Hebron lines. All With right. the snap, Good. he's coming across that, the oh! Intercept. He got, it. He he got, got it. it. Great job in there. That's number eight, Tom, for the Panthers. Number eight is, I got you, Alan. Man. Number eight is Taz Gordon. Gordon. Yep. Man, and he did. That's just what you want your linebacker to do. He dropped back in his hook zone. He doesn't have, he has no responsibility other than the middle of the field. Great job by the linebacker coach for Clinch County, and that's Coach Vince, I think, the yep. new coach we got. Oh. Had him coached up there and picks it off. You see Coach Vince there. He's excited. Man, that was big because it was fitting to be a two-possession game. Yes, it Tom. was. No, that's three turnovers tonight for Hebron. I mean, you and that makes a difference. It's hard to come to Clinch County and turn the ball over three times yep. at any time, <clears throat> especially in one half. Now the Panthers have three minutes to, to score right here, and I – Hebron gets the ball the second half. That's right. Start the second half. That's so that, was was a, that was that, huge. That was huge right there. Panthers going to run that power sweep off tackle. Lowers his head. Let's see if he put the nah, ball on the dirt. He was down. He was down. Nope. No. Turnover. Turn oh, it right back said, over to him. That was Michael Walker, I think. Oh, no. The white cap saying he was down. No, that was Moorhead. Moorhead. So second boy. down. Oh, one had to turn him, but look, that's why he's got the white hat on. Yep. He, he's the one that Man said it. he was down. Panthers get away there, second and six, second and four now. 
clock running. So what Coach Rant? Two minutes, 30 here. seconds left. I want to remind you the Panther Band of Pride will be on here at halftime. Y'all hang around. Got a got band director. There we come with the counter, Tom. We've done scored one time on that. He gets there he outside. Goes. Oh. oh. Walker scored what? About 85 run yep, early. About in the 80, game. yeah. <laughs> if he ever he had one man to beat, and he'd have been gone again. That'll stop the clock. First and ten for the Panthers. They get it out to the 30 now. I think the Panthers have two timeouts left. There's a good shot. You can see the crowd. It's full tonight here at Donald Tyson Field. Yes, it is. We got you see Coach Langston Hendricks. Yep, that's who the third coach was up that's there, right, Alan. He um, he's going to school. He's going to be a community <coughs> coach until he gets his degree, and he's going to make man, a man. He's going to make a great coach. He will. Boy, they're going to run that weak lead back the other way. Good job by Hebron to clog it up. Big 56 in there on the tackle. His helmet will roll off. That is Cameron Benson. He'll have to come out for play. Along in there with number 51, and that is Jake Time. Time, I think, is what it is. Clock is running. That's going to bring up second and seven for the Panthers. Oh, Chad Robbins said, <laughs> Somebody from Atlanta gonna drive all the way down here and get me and you from not pronouncing Hebron wrong. Oh, but I think that we're saying it right. They yeah. say it wrong. That's right. I mean, I I can't help it. <laughs> Silent letters have always been a problem for <laughs> me. <laughs> I don't even know why they I mean, exist. <laughs> I don't know how he's supposed to say Hebron, but Hebron. I mean. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, surely, uh, and surely look, they know how to pronounce the that, name of their own town the that, correct way. I, you know, and and I have it wrong way more than I have it right most of the time. Well, Third and three, clock running. Coach Tyson saying, "Look, we're gonna run a few plays. If we get it, we get it. If we don't, we're going in at halftime." Oh, good, good block, block out there, and that's number and three, and we're gonna get the first down. Going. Tom, that's the best block of the night, and that is. Demondre Edmonds out there. He knocked one down and was going to get another one. Yeah. Man, some good blood. That'll stop the clock with 11 seconds to go. Oh, Tank's still out there. He's really dozier, but I call him Tank. That's He's right. A Representing DuPont. Yep. Panthers will call a Senior timeout. Senior offensive lineman with 11 Point nine seconds left to go. I guarantee you they're fixing to throw a bomb to you number think? 11. I would Jeez. just throw it up. Yeah. Uh, you know, really, Tom, if you get 20 yards here, Robbins can attempt. Yep. If we get to the 35, Coach Tyson will He might let, let him. him. Yeah, he'll give let it a him shot, try. Right? Well, we got 11.9 got seconds left to get down there and do that. And, all right, what are we shot doing? There we coaches, go. Come on. Joey and Blake and Langston. Yep. There's a. Uh, Coach Carroll's getting ready. We want to remind we're going to come to Coach Carroll right at halftime. So y'all hang around right before half. We'll come to Coach Carroll. Me and Tom will get him. He's probably yep. going to get Coach Tyson. Uh, get him going into the locker room. There's Gary Allen. Man, Mr. Gary's been on that sideline for many years. Many you know? years. Our sheriff's department got some season. I've never seen another uniform. I hadn't either. I hadn't either. <laughs> I never have. <clears throat> All right, let's well, see what we they go. come out with. And it is. They're trying to get Jeremiah coming across gotta the middle. Got to throw it. Got to throw it. Look and look, oh. and he'll throw it, and he'll catch it, but they that ain't going to matter. Back. That ain't going to help him. That's gonna, he's going to pick They're up going, nine. All right, the clock's going to run out. See, we, somebody called well. a timeout. Panthers must have had one timeout left. Nope, that's it, Tom. Yep. Well, that's going to make the score 20 to nothing. Panthers are up. Coach Tyson's saying, I wanted a timeout. See the referee is Let's see what they do. Let's see what they do. They're going to call them back out, Alan. Now, if I'm a Hebron, yeah. I'm not coming. I'm not stopping. I'm, I'm not either. Y'all go, boys. 
Coach Tyson will be aggravated about that because you, ne you want to use your timeout. Yeah, that's and right. And he's trying to. So we'll get yeah, Ebron didn't stop. No. Hey, uh -uh. And, you know, I wouldn't have neither if I, I wouldn't have Y'all go. So we're waiting, Coach Tyson. Dad had to pull us out of the locker room. You can see it. The line is fixing to get long at the concession yes, stand. Yes, it is. See Coach Carroll there waiting. Everybody going to the locker room. There's big Gabriel Morris walking by. Yep. There's Moten oh. there. Bunch of great kids. Tim's going to have to be a little bit faster and beat Harris to the Man, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Boogie's got to get out there quick. Uh, he's going to let him go, so we're getting ready. Tim's coming to him. All right, Boogie. He's getting Coach Tyson. Hang on just a second. Two, one. Come on, Boogie. I'm Tyson. First quarter. Coach, coach, 20 to nothing. Good start. Half. Blocking very well up front, but they're quick. You know, they got a good defense. You know, I got to give them a lot of credit there. You know, so, but they're a good football team. You know, I just uh, worried about, you know, this heat and the humidity. Guys, you know, getting tired, you know, but, uh, you know, we've been working hard, so hopefully that'll pay off. You know, we'll see. It's this week, you know, to tighten up. We got to play a lot better in the second half because the way they, that quarterback they have is, you know, they got guys that can get open and um, and they're good enough on defense to stop us a little bit. You know, they can score in a hurry if they get some momentum. So we got to, you know, we got to come out and play ball. Okay. Uh, we'll see you in the second half. Thanks. 10-4, back to y'all. Yeah, I got you. And then a Lockheed Walker Jones. Walker Jones is proud to welcome a new addition to the Walker Jones family of dealerships. Announcing Walker Jones Nissan. Nissan, innovation that excites. And you should expect the same great service at the newest home of the lifetime warranty. Lifetime. Now more than ever, we've got it all. So why shop anywhere else? Walker Jones Automotive Superstore. Now on both sides of Memorial Drive in Waycross. Get the best deal from
Safety Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Winky's Southern Styles in Homerville is the go-to place for custom embroidery and vinyl transfer designs. Whether it's t-shirts, caps, or special Christmas items, Winky's will make it happen. Go by our location at 44 East Elna Street in Homerville and see Lenora for embroidery and vinyl transfer. Winky Southern Styles supports the Panthers in their quest for another state championship. Go Panthers! Jerry J's Hog and Bones in Homerville is the restaurant for any time of day. Whether it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, or that special holiday meal. From pancakes to pulled pork and chicken salad to ribeye steak, Jerry J's Hog and Bones has the best food and service around. Oh yeah, and don't forget our great catering service. Go Panthers! Homerville Feed and Seed can provide nearly all of your farming related needs including seed, corn, bulk fertilizer, herbicides, insecticides, and a large variety of other farm products. Evely and Nick want to remind you that you do not have to shop out of town to find the lowest prices. Our prices are as low or lower than any of those out of town companies. Come by and let the friendly staff at Homerville Feed and Seed help you select the farm products you need at the lowest prices around. Since 1972, Popeyes has been serving up mouth-watering, delicious, hot, and mild fried chicken and chicken tenders from its Louisiana kitchen. You know about our great chicken, but have you tried our tasty seafood? All of our menu items come with a southern style all their own. On your way to or after the game, stop by Popeyes and remember we can handle all your special event catering needs. Conveniently located on Memorial Drive in Waycross, Popeyes puts a piece of Louisiana in every single meal. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. Camping World of Aldosta, located in Lake Park, is your one-stop destination for all your camping needs. Stop by to see your dreams of quality time with your family become a reality. Whether it's tailgating with your air-conditioned camper, taking a trip to the mountains or beach with your family, or driving your motorhome to a faraway destination, Camping World has it all. Let us put you and your family in a camper for as little as $99 per month. And remember, when you buy a camper from Camping World of Valdosta, you receive a free Elite Good Sam membership, roadside assistance, and travel assist for one year. You're watching Creek Box TV. Is Jesus Christ your steering wheel or your spare tire? Sadly, for many, it's a spare tire. We go through life not worrying about the consequences to our actions until we get into a bind, then we call on Jesus to bail us out. For others who accept him as their Lord and Savior, he is their steering wheel. They realize as they walk through life, he'll be with them step by step, guiding them to their final destination, heaven and eternal life. Which one is it for you? At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll, 912 490-7142 Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas has the cheapest prices in South Georgia and a huge inventory of new and used gas and electric golf carts and off-road vehicles. Mike's also has parts and accessories and proudly serves customers across the states of Georgia, Florida, and Alabama. 
Whether you stop into our store or shop with us online, we have everything you need for Can-Am, Easy Go, Club Car, and Yamaha. 0% financing available for qualified customers. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas, Georgia. Come out to Lolita's for the best cold treats and hot sweets around. You'll be glad you did. Located on Highway 84 East in Homerville, Lolita invites everyone to enjoy our outdoor seating, our New Orleans-style snowballs, and fresh mouth-watering beignets. Don't forget our tasty chili dogs. For your convenience, Lolita's is open Monday through Saturday from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Come cool off or heat up at Lolita's, East Highway 84 in Homerville. Homerville Jewelers on East Dame Avenue is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. If you're looking for that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby, look no further. We also have a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches, and necklaces and can perform jewelry repair. No need to shop out of town, we can supply all of your gift and jewelry needs. Let Vicki Young and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Lutz, Brown, Pigler, and Manley Insurance Agency is locally owned and has been a part of the Homerville, Clinch County community for many years. We make it a priority to know our clients on a personal basis and take pride in customizing insurance coverage for the particular needs of each customer. We offer all lines of insurance, including auto, home, business, life insurance, annuities, and bonds. Lutz, Brown, Pigler, and Manley Insurance Agency, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Go Panthers! You know, one of the devil's favorite tools is to tell us we have plenty of time. Like, uh, one day I'll get straight with God whenever I'm a little older, or, or I got some cleaning up to do before I even think about going to church. But the Bible tells us in James chapter 4 that we're not promised tomorrow. And in 2 Corinthians, today is a day of salvation. Don't wait. Come to Jesus today just as you are. You're watching Backroad Sports on Creekbox TV. And then a Lockheed Walker Jones. Walker Jones is proud to welcome a new addition to the Walker Jones family of dealerships. Announcing Walker Jones Nissan. Nissan, innovation that excites. And you should expect the same great service at the newest home of the lifetime warranty. Lifetime. Now more than ever, we've got it all. So why shop anywhere else? Walker Jones Automotive Superstore. Now on both sides of Memorial Drive in Waycross. Get the best deal from Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Winky's Southern Styles in Homerville is the go-to place for custom embroidery and vinyl transfer designs. Whether it's t-shirts, caps, or special Christmas items, Winky's will make it happen. Go by our location at 44 East Elna Street in Homerville and see Lenora for embroidery and vinyl transfer. Winky Southern Styles supports the Panthers in their quest for another state championship. Go Panthers! Jerry J's Hog and Bones in Homerville is the restaurant for any time of day, whether it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, or that special holiday meal. From pancakes to pulled pork and chicken salad to ribeye steak, Jerry J's Hog and Bones has the best food and service around. Oh yeah, and don't forget our great catering service. Go Panthers! Homerville Feed and Seed can provide nearly all of your farming related needs, including seed, corn, bulk fertilizer, herbicides, insecticides, and a large variety of other farm products. Evely and Nick want to remind you that you do not have to shop out of town to find the lowest prices. Our prices are as low or lower than any of those out-of-town companies. 
Come by and let the friendly staff at Homerville Feed and Seed help you select the farm products you need at the lowest prices around. Good evening. We hope everybody enjoyed the band of pride. Man, they started off to a good year. We're getting bands doing great. <clears throat> uh, Tom, you got some stats for us, man. Craig Gaines us sent us some stats. We appreciate him keeping them on the sideline for us. Yep. Oh, Hebron's got a rushing. They've got 53 yards and passing. They've got 39 for a total of 87 yards for the first half. Clinch has 177 rushing yards and nine yards passing for a total of 186 yards. Um, so the Panthers have outgained them 100 yards. And, you know, we half. were talking to Tim at halftime, and, you know, it's 20 to nothing, but he's right. Two big plays, Tom. Uh, yeah, that's had right. Had a 70-yard pick six and an 85-yard run by Michael Wal <clears throat> uh, Walker, and the score six to nothing. So, uh, you know, been in a Panthers been in a turnovers have has killed yep, Hebron. They have. They've got three. Man, Sam Hendricks sent me a text. Uh, he says we want to give a shout out to Andy Hendricks. He is in the hospital over in Valosta after having a stroke. He is watching Creek Box. We just want to give him a shout out for him to get better, and we love him. From all his kids and grandkids and great grandkids, thanks. So y'all keep uh, Mr. Andy Hendricks in yeah, your prayers right. over in Valosta. All right, you got me back on yeah, the live man. chat. Yeah, I wonder what Here's the Panthers. Coach Tyson in his first halftime. Official halftime as the head coach, regular season. There's the fans. Let's look for Doreen. You know Doreen's know. right here somewhere. Dooley and Trent. Doreen's old in the concession. Yeah. Yeah, Doreen is in the concession probably. I'm looking for Dooley and Trini and Ned. I know they're up there somewhere. Hebron will get the ball. Here we go. We got a good shot. Tom looking in here. I'm looking. Yeah, there's Dallas. I see Dallas. Uh, there's a. Uh, you can tell the game hadn't started back here. Everybody's just kind of. There's Dre, son. Little Dre. I'm looking for AC. Look at that. There they're they're waving. They're waving. Everybody's there's waving. Kimbo. Yeah, man. Kim, don't miss a game. No, she, there's a leg. Wait, man, <laughs> I missed him. I wish I, we got to get, hey, tell Brad to zoom back in on Alexis again. <laughs> yeah. With that big hat on. Uh, we'll get, we'll that get, wasn't Alexis. That was, was Mr. Ale Green, no. Gene, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get his picture. We'll bring that up at the next city council meeting. I can tell you that right now. Get him, get him to wear that hat again. We're coming out after halftime, man. Unlock your phone. Uh, Hebron will get the ball. Man, they need to drive down and score here, Tom. Get back in this game. Panthers lead 20 to nothing to kick off the 2019 season. I'm going to text Alexis. Hey, where'd you get a hat? We're getting ready for the kickoff. Zach Robbins is getting it right on the tee. Man, Miss Lisa, that banana pudding's been butchered up out here. That I didn't even time. I didn't even get any more second. You half left time. me talking. I was still talking, and I looked up and he was out the door, <laughs> over there standing by the fence like a little young and hiding. Tom's got banana pudding on both earlobes. Tried to eat it all before anybody could get out the door. Uh, and Tom oh, made man. himself sick eating it. Good kick by Robbins. Going to come down to the left inside the 10. Look out. <coughs> He's going to break it to the outside. Oh, Good man. Return. Good return. Great job. Great job in there by number six, and that is Donovan Moore <coughs> with a good return. First time he's touched the ball tonight. <coughs> Bring it out all the way down to the 42-yard yep. line. Panthers defense has played great tonight. Hebron's had a couple of drives, but Panthers let him get close. There's another shot of the crowd. Nobody's uptown. Everybody's here at the 
There's Monk, big Monk from Fargo and wife yeah. Linda. Panthers staying a 4-2. Good hit behind the line, but he's going to bounce. And as Dorsey had him behind the line, he'd done a great job spinning and get it, getting away. That's Ethan Burroughs just to get back to the line of scrimmage. <clears throat> Let's bring up second 10. Look at, well, I think we have one down. And, Tom, we do. We got a man down it. With that, I guess we can go and take yeah, a Yeah, we'll take a short timeout. We'll be right back in 30 seconds. Since 1972, Popeye's has been serving up mouth-watering, delicious, hot, and mild fried chicken and chicken tenders from its Louisiana kitchen. You know about our great chicken, but have you tried our tasty seafood? All of our menu items come with a southern style all their own. On your way to or after the game, stop by Popeye's and remember we can handle all your special event catering needs. Conveniently located on Memorial Drive in Waycross, Popeye's put the pizza Louisiana in every single meal. All right, Tom, we're, we're back. Yourself. All right, wait a minute. Maybe we're finna get Alexis' hat again. There he is. Go to the right, Brad. Go to the right, Brad. Go to the right, Brad. That's Mr. Green Gene. Here he is. Right there. Right there. <laughs> yeah, he'll be proud of yeah, that. Yeah, that right there is going on the city page. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wish I wish when we had it on him when he got the text. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll send him the pictures I just took. We got Mike Martin, Tom, watching from Clemson, South Carolina, home of the national champions. I got a pretty good coach there, too, Mr. Mike. And he says the Hebron quarterback is Colton Gaither. So, uh. <clears throat> We've been I'm calling looking. the wrong name. Well, I don't have, uh, number four is Kendall Bell on there, Mr. Mike. I don't have a, Colton Gaither's number 18 on the roster. So if that's Gaither, he just makes a great, a great throw. pass. He calls it touchdown. So we got the name right, I guess, and he throws yeah, a touchdown. We're gonna have to call him Jim Man, Bob or something. That was a uh, just a go route. Yep. And hit him in stride, Tom. And that's just what Hebron needed to get back in this game. It's twenty to six now. Jimmy Rigdon's watching, and Norris Maddox and his crew's watching tonight. He texts me. All right, Norris. So the Panthers come out a little flat, and Hebron comes out with a skip in their step, and they're on the board. This next possession by the Panthers is going to be huge. See what this is going to do for Hebron. We got the extra point on the way. The kick is up, straight through the middle, and it's a two possession game now. 20 to yep, 7. 20 to 7. <clears throat> we appreciate everybody tuning in on YouTube tonight. Y'all be sure and subscribe so we can get you all the messages. You can see they've made and got some snow cones cooling off at halftime. Much of the Hebron crowd. Panthers getting ready to get the return on. Coach Winston's out there calling his play. There's a shot of Hebron's crowd. Yeah. They've had a long day. It's going to be a long night. It's going to be a long, yeah. They might They'll make it back, back to what, about four? Tifton, probably. Uh, I'd just go to Tifton. Uh, I know that was a long ride coming home last year from way up there. But you're talking about a nice facility. That's yeah. about as nice. Yep. Hebron has the nicest facility in Class A. Yep. The locker rooms were unreal up there in the, <clears> the stadium <throat> with the turf. You know, they're coming out. How many kids is, are we dressing out, Alan? Man, we're dressing out probably between 50 and 60, I'd yep. say, Tom. All right, here comes Hebron. They're going to kick off to the Panthers. I'm sure we have Moorhead deep. And 
And that is number 99. And number 99 is getting Jake. in just the right spot. He finna put it through the end zone. And that is Jack Redmond. He does. He get a little layer up yep. under it. Going to come down about the 15. All right, there we go. He, Morehead up the middle. Moving. Out. Got one man to beat the kicker. There he goes. I don't think they're going to I don't think him. he's going to catch him. And just he's like He's trying. That, man, he brought Just like that, Morehead puts us back. 85 <coughs> yards. Tom, they have just got that's back two, in the game. That's two runs that the Panthers have had over 80 yards tonight. That is huge, man. If you're the coach over at Hebron, that's just so frustrating. You get back in it. It's a two-possession game. Uh, and, and, you know, the Panthers, it, that's one advantage the Panther has their speed. And, that, I mean, special mm -hmm. teams will kill you with speed. You see, here comes the cheerleaders, Tom. CCHS signs. Here comes the extra point. Zach Robbins on to attempt it. He is two for two tonight. The first, that one he missed, he didn't miss it. Never got yeah, put never, down. Never put his foot on the ball. Put it down, that one's blocked. They got a good rush up the middle <coughs> and blocked it. And Zach, boy, that's frustrating as a kicker. That's yeah. going to leave it 26 to seven, Tom. Yep. All right, and there's 11 minutes and 10 seconds left to go in the third quarter. We'll be back in 15 seconds. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. Camping World of Aldosta, located in Lake Park, is your one-stop destination for all your camping needs. Stop by to see your dreams of quality time with your family become a reality. Whether it's tailgating with your air-conditioned camper, taking a trip to the mountains or beach with your family, or driving your motorhome to a faraway destination, Camping World has it all. Let us put you and your family in a camper for as little as $99 per month. And remember, when you buy a camper from Camping World of Valdosta, you receive a free Elite Good Sam membership, roadside assistance, and travel assist for one year. You're watching Creek Box TV. All right, welcome back to Creek Box TV. Hebron made it 20 to 7. They got back within two scores and uh, they kick off, and Moorhead takes it on the 15 and rumbles 85 yards to make it a three possession game again. It is 26 Man, I, to 7, Tom. I don't know what I've done. Uh, I know I seen on there we got somebody out in Hawaii watching. Yep. Appreciate them tuning in. There's Miss Carla Daniels. I know Wade's watching at the house. He doesn't miss nothing on Creek Box. We want to wish him well. I've got. There we go. Robbins is going to put it down at about the three. It'll bounce to the one. And they said it went into the end zone, I think. It's a great job by Robbins. Yep. Bennett Water says Hebron's quarterback is Colton. Yep. Well, he just threw a heck of a pass yes, a while did. ago. Yep, Sam, Sam, Sam Hewell Irwin. He's watching his little brother from Hawaii. Right. Mr. Jimmy Rigdon's at home watching. All right, Alan, here we go. All right, they stay in the spread. Panthers stay in a 4-2. They got a corner walked up. He's going to blitz on that side. Well, he's taking his time. He's calling the play. I think we might have a delay a game. Let's see right here. The referee's going to come in. Let's see who they're going to back up. And it is Hebron. I think it's a delay a game. So it's going to make it first and 15 now. They're going the other direction. They need to come out and answer the Panthers right here. There's been 13 points scored 
and 51 seconds, Tom. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah that's right. <laughs> you know. <clears throat> they line back up, trying to get a playoff now. Gaithier looks back. He's going back down the sideline. Had him there, just overthrew him. He had a step. On number five for the Panthers, and that is, let me look right here. That is right. uh, Deron Simon. I was started to say Simone. <coughs> Simone. Oh, Carter Geese said give a big hello to me. All right. Oh, hello man. there, Mr. Carter. Shot Hebron's crowd. They're <laughs> ready to get on the road. All right, they're trying to get around the end now. Let's see, we got another penalty, Tom. See who that's going to be on. <clears throat> it was second and 15. Pretty good first half game. There wasn't that many penalties. We're starting off the second half a little sloppy. Man, we got a good lineup of sponsors this year so far. Jerry J's Hog and Bone, Lutz and Brown, Winkies. Dairy Queen and Popeyes, Lee Engineer, and Homerville's that feed and see. Yeah, feed and see. That you should have been an S. Feed and see. <laughs> yeah. Allen's got Homerville F and C. <laughs> feed and <laughs> seed. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> I was trying to, Daniel was calling it out, and I was trying to keep up with him. F and C. <laughs> feed Mike's and see. Call, call, our new one is Walker Jones, brother, uh, Nissan of Waycross. Uh, we want to be sure and get all them out. Good play by the Panthers. They hit him behind the line. I thought it was the first Baptist church. You couldn't, you couldn't tell it was feed and seed. <laughs> hey. Tell it's been a long night tonight. No, you did that early on. <laughs> yeah, I did. I did that she right when it. I first got here. <laughs> <laughs> as long as we didn't leave nobody off, brother. <laughs> yeah. What's Homerville F and C? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do you call that? Uh, uh, when, when you write letters backwards, what, what am I? What, Dyslexia yeah. or something like that, yeah. I might have a little bit of that. <laughs> Bubba Bubba Clyde. Hey, got us. Thank you, Gatorade. Powerade got a sucker. And Brad doing some good camera work. <laughs> All right, it's fourth down and ten. Panthers defense come out. He's gonna punt it. Midfield. Moore and catches it on one hop. And he'll step out of bounds at about midfield. We'll go and we'll take a break with the Panthers leading 26 to 7. Is Jesus Christ your steering wheel or your spare tire? Sadly, for many, it's a spare tire. We go through life not worrying about the consequences to our actions until we get into a bind. Then we call on Jesus to bail us out. For others who accept him as their Lord and Savior, he is their steering wheel. They realize as they walk through life, he'll be with them step by step guide them to their final destination, heaven and eternal life. Which one is it for you? At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll, 912-490-7142. Yeah, we'll do that. Well, Tom, we had a penalty, but I guess they declined it. So the Panthers will take over at the or their own 49, run it off tackle. First and, and about, about 15, yard. so that's going to be second and 14. <coughs> 
Panthers defense will stand up and got them to punt the ball. It's 26 to seven here in the third. You know, they've done a pretty good <clears throat> job of, uh, Jeremiah's been open a couple of times and just overthrew him. He had one completion, <clears throat> uh, one catch there right before half for about nine yards. Panthers break the huddle. They have wing to the right. Well, Carter says hello to Jim and Alec Calvert. They're watching. There's Moorhead. Tommy got the corner, and he'll Man, pick Moorhead's up. Moorhead's had a great night. He <laughs> just picked up 11 there. <clears throat> if he gets that outside and makes one step, you're not going to run him down from yep. behind. You know, he's a junior, and I think Florida State has offered him. Have they? Yeah. yeah. I know that Robbins has had a couple of offers. Yeah, yep. you know. And uh, you got Jeremiah. There's two or, th two or three more that yep. have had, you know, the colleges are looking at. Don McCoy says, Harry Wayne's laughing at you about F and C. Yeah, I thought he was laughing about the other. <laughs> yeah, about hey, the here comes the counter back. Ooh, still going. Man, great job in there by number three, and Just that is DeMondre Edmonds. Edmonds. <coughs> We've had, what, four or five different backs touch the ball tonight. Yep. Walker, Edmonds, Moorhead, uh, Dorsey. Coach Rance mixing it up good. Well, going to be second and two at eight minutes and 21 seconds left Panther. in the third quarter. They break the huddle. They got <laughs> wing to the right. They're going to run it right up the middle with Dorsey. Good job by Hebron. They'll wrap him up. Trying, trying to strip, to strip the, ball. the ball. It's a good job holding on to that. Lost a shoe. Yeah. <clears throat> See, everybody's still fanning, Thomas. Yeah, it's hot out there. Humid, man. You can still see Alexis's hat. Kind of like, where's Waldo? Where's Alexis? Yeah. I was looking Leon. You, there's Leon. I see his hat. Now. Yeah, Leon's orange got hat. another hat, too. <laughs> orange hat like Alexis's. Finally <clears> see <throat> it. All right. Panthers got the wing to the left this time. Moorhead takes the snap off tackle, runs over one, leans forward. It's going to, I think he got it. Yep, first and 10. Good job by Moorhead to get the first down. Well, Car change. Carter's wanting to go eat after the game, wants to know a place to go eat. About the only thing going to be open after the game. The Dairy Queen going to be open? Yeah, Ash usually stays yeah, open Yeah, Dairy Friday. Queen, that's south of town on 441. Go through the, red, the one red light and keep heading south, or the Huddle House will be open. Yeah, that's um, it. That's Huddle House is Huey's on and the west gonna, side. We're picking Huey's up as a sponsor. You can order a pizza. I've, I talked to him okay. today. So uh, next uh, <clears throat> week we'll have Huey's on board. We'll have their and man, good run, run over one. He done a great job to hang on at his ankles, Tom. <clears throat> man, that was a hard collision there. Great job. That's 51. Fought through the backfield, and that is Jack Um. Man, that was a hard lick. Probably the hardest lick of the night. Be Greg Smith over there holding the chain. Well, Morris Landrum, him and Miss Lars watching from home. Good, man. <coughs> All right, here come the Panthers. They break the huddle, wing to the right. Gonna run the counter back to the left, and man, there's Walker again. That's gonna be a touchdown. Yep. No one there. They were waiting on the sweep. Panthers do a great job. Run the counter back weak. <clears throat> great blocking downfield by Jeremiah, keeping his man from making the tackle, and that's gonna make it 32 to seven now. Hebron had just got back into the game. That'll bring Robbins back out to kick. And Montgomery is the holder for the Panthers. Panthers trying to add another point here. All right, Robbins. Got last one got blocked. Here we go. And get this one off. <clears throat> and it's good. 33 to 7, Tom. Yep. All right, that's going to leave six minutes left to go in the third quarter. We'll be back in 25 seconds.
You're watching Creekbox TV. Hi, I'm David Johnson, pastor at Trinity Baptist Church. Man, Jesus has dramatically changed my life. And I want you to know he'll do the same for you if you'll give him that opportunity. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll, 912-490-7142. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas has the cheapest prices in South Georgia and a huge inventory of new and used gas and electric golf carts and off-road vehicles. Mike's also has parts and accessories and proudly serves customers across the states of Georgia, Florida, and Alabama. Whether you stop into our store or shop with us online, we have everything you need for Can-Am, Easy Go, Club Car, and Yamaha. 0% financing available for qualified customers. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas, Georgia. <clears throat> All right, Tom, we're back here at Donald Tyson Field. The Panthers leading 33 to seven over the Hebron Christian Academy lines from Atlanta. Robbins will kick, a good shot, Tom. Get up under it, it's gonna kick it to the left, deep. Good kick. Inside All the, way the down. 10. Yep, to the 10. He's trying to weave. Boy, he got hit. Good coverage by the Panthers downfield. 56. There's big Jackson Henderson yep. down there Jackson, making, Jackson, Jackson. making a tackle. He'll slip <coughs> down the field. He's a tight end, guard. He plays a little bit of everything. Defensive end, special teams. And <laughs> Coach Red's Kabot over on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody said they saw him in Argyle the other day. <laughs> Not really, but, yeah, uh, you know. <laughs> that's right. The man, I think it was Brian Coleman. said, man, I just passed Coach Red going towards Waycross <laughs> in Argyle. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hebron comes out in that spread now. they got to hurry up and try to get some points scored here. Oh, Ooh. boy, there was some heat coming. Had to get rid of it. <clears throat> Good catch. Panthers went for the pick. Look out, just too much speed. Great job. Man, you can see he went Ooh, for it. Oh, I almost Tom. got the pick too, Alan. That was Perry <clears throat> Williams he going for the pick, but he, he did hustle him and got him back down about the 30-yard line. Big play for the Lions. And the Lions have picked up a few more yards this second half. And that is cold. <clears throat> and it seems Daughtry. like this is just lasting forever. I mean, there's still five minutes left to go in the third it. quarter. Well, the big plays. You know. <clears throat> yep. There's Colton back. He's going to look. He's going to throw that pass again. Good pass. Oh, and we're going to have interference Prince. on the Panthers. So that'll be a 10-yard penalty, another first down. That's number 10 without their covering for the Panthers, and that is Perry Williams. Thought he had a pick just a minute ago. So they'll count off 10 yards and do it over. Seems like when they go hurry up, they move the ball, you know, hit the Panthers with the big play. Yeah. <clears throat> Come back into that spread that's stacked up with two wing backs. Particularly like that. He's going to throw a one to the Ooh, corner touchdown. Man, what a pass. Man, what a pass. You cannot defend that pass there. No, Great you can't. pass and catch. That is number six out there, and that is Donovan Moore. Panthers with pretty good cover. They had one over the top. Double covered, but man, he just laid the ball where only he could catch it, Tom. Oh, and there's, and that's, a, flag. there's a flag on the receiver down. Man, field. that's that's a hard look for. Oh man, 
for the lines. Oh, hold. <coughs> that, that's just like a turnover. Yep. Man, that's going to back them up 10 yards. Mm. You know, as a coach, you, you, that's got to be frustrating. Because you take away all the big plays and everybody's, you know, it's, it's probably a tie game here. Here come the Panthers rushing. Colton will roll out. He'll have to get rid of it. Trying to get it back out there more. Comes Austin Peterson off the field. Oh, Carter says ESPN needs to hire me and you. Alan. That's right, man. <laughs> I don't know if we, I don't know if we're ESPN <laughs> material, but we we try our best. <clears throat> I got to make it interesting, man. That's right. Open oh, the Panthers will jump off sides. That's the first time they've jumped off sides all night, though. That's going to bring up second and 15 now. I know Coach Winston has worked on that all week. Really for the last two weeks since the scrimmage game. Here we go. Second and four down territory for Hebron. They've got to get on the board. Look in. He's going to tuck it and run. run. Oh, out. man. He's going to make it, Adam. Touchdown. Great good, job by good the Good running by number four. That's Colt, Colton <coughs> Guthrie. Hope I'm pronouncing that last name right. Old number 13 just had the wrong line on him. So they come back and they make it 33 to 13. Still five minutes to go in the third, Tom. <coughs> That'll bring out number 99, Jack Redmond to try the extra point. Number 11 is your holder, Nate Coker. <laughs> Alan, I think some of the Hebron guys are messing with us. They think I won't call them out, but I will. <laughs> <coughs> he said, uh, "He said you're the type of guys I'd want to marry my sister." Yeah, you. He go. said, "Or daughter." <laughs> and boys, just <it's> not. <laughs> we appreciate them tuning in and watching, yeah. man. Try to have a big time. All right, Tom, we can take a break. Five Tyler. minutes and five seconds left. We'll take an 18-second timeout. We'll be right back. Come out to Lolita's for the best cold treats and hot sweets around. You'll be glad you did. Located on Highway 84 East in Homerville, Lolita invites everyone to enjoy our outdoor seating, our New Orleans-style snowballs, and fresh mouth-watering beignets. Don't forget our tasty chili dogs. For your convenience, Lolita's is open Monday through Saturday from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Come cool off or heat up at Lolita's, East Highway 84 in Homerville. All right, Tom, we must have an injury on the field. The cheerleaders are taking <coughs> a knee. All right, we're waiting on right, Tim. I think All Tim, right. yeah, there he is. Folks, here we are Come in on, the Luke. third quarter, clinched with the 33-14 lead. It's been exciting third quarter. Uh, Hebron opened the scoring with a long touchdown pass. Clinch came right back with an 85-yard kickoff return. Clinch comes back on a long run again on Tyler Moorhead, gets loose for a touchdown, and now Hebron has come alive passing the ball. They didn't throw it much in the first half. They've come alive, actually had one get called back, but then the quarterback with a long run to pedal back into it and make it 33 to 33-14. So we're just still in the middle of the third quarter. So, folks, it's still too early to, to put this one in the books. Better stay tuned. Back to y'all. <laughs> All right, Booger, we appreciate it, man. You Tim thought somebody was sneaking up behind him. Yeah. All right. Man, and it has. It's been a long it game. It has been a long game. There's a shot of the people standing along the fence. There's a Willie. Yeah. Willie three. Got a lot good crowd. Well, zoom out. Here we go. Alexis Here's is Alexis still, still here. here with his hat. Old Dallas. Picture, old boy. Tell Dallas he needs a haircut. Man, there's still a good crowd here for the Panthers. Well, Dondre Lacey said he's been trying to give you money to sponsor on Creek Box for a year and a half, and you just won't Man. come see him. 
I'll see him next week for sure. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Dondre, I'll send him to you. If not, I'll come get with Dondre. I'll get me some wings. I'll work out a deal. He can pay. Yeah. He can pay in wings. Barry <laughs> might not like that. Yeah. <coughs> Short kick to the twenty. Panther, that's Perry Williams. He's gonna take it to the left. Good block, Good block. out there. He cuts back. Look out, Tom. He could take it to back the house again. The field. One, two, three, four, five. Trying to run him down. Another Look block. And oh, he, oh, oh got, he got in. in. No, no to the, come tell on, me, give man. It to give him. it to him. You got to give it to him. He went out at the one <laughs> foot yard <laughs> he line. He ran about 150 yards back and forth and back and forth. The one yard, one yard line, line. man. A 85 yard return and a 79 yard return. Coach Winston will be tickled about that. That's just ugly, that umpire. He ought to give him <laughs> that one yard. I thought the he cheerleaders fell in. thought he got it. Yeah. They're, they're running with the flags. Yeah, they think he got I thought he got in too, but. Uh, he did. They need to call up here to the box for the instant replay. Right. We'll, we'll, we'll tell them he scored. Coach Tyson needs to. Uh, Throw his flag down. Yeah. There's a shot of the flag girls in the band. Uh, now there's a flag on the play. Must have been because we were celebrating. They didn't know. give it the score. And Tom, it run eight seconds off <laughs> the clock. <God. laughs> you know, I mean, that's why the game is taking. It's just big plays. Panther, here come the <laughs> offense. They're having to run back on the field. <laughs> Oh, Alex said, ask Alexis where he got that hat from. I've already asked him. He's on the city council in Homerville. I've already asked him. He won't tell me. He just said he's going to get me one like it. Hey. So I think uh, Hebron called a timeout, or it might have been the Panthers. Uh, when you have a big play like that, a lot of the linemen was over there drinking yep. Gatorade. They wasn't set up. Hey. Hey, somebody just texted to we're out of sync. Oh. Uh. Looking at a shot, man. The field looks great. Well, Chad Robbins said we're out of sync, Alan. With the the videos not matching the audio, right. maybe we need There's to talk coach, slower. Coach, yeah, they're going over <laughs> dance steps. Coach yep. Carroll's trying coach to Carroll's teach him trying how to, to break <laughs> dance. See, Brad. Yeah, see, you go left <laughs> and, go, and go back over to the right. Brad is yep. The dancing king. I'll play Brad's part. You play Tim's part. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Serious conversation yep. going on right there, folks. He said no. Uh, see, look, you go, you see, go slide bookie. to the left, and slide to the right. Bookie's got, he's well, he's got, got some now. moves now. He's going to be mad at you. There's Barry. And hey, that's the boss man right there. He's walked up and down them bleachers. I couldn't have done it. I couldn't have done it. I'm uh, glad they don't have cameras on us. Yeah. <laughs> Panthers, Dorsey up the middle, touchdown. Good blocking in there by the line. <clears throat> Dorsey was trying to jump and dive a little bit, and he didn't have to. He's already in the end zone. 39 to 14 now. Panthers answer he brought every time. While they come down the field, puts seven up, and here come the Panthers with a big return. You know, I mean. And it's all been big plays, really, tonight, yep. Tom. <clears throat> and that's one thing the Panthers like to chew up the clock with long drives, and they hadn't had to. They hadn't had that's to one tonight. of the games so long. <clears throat> Number 75 saying, call in kicking team. Robbins was looking for the ball. He likes to kick on the sideline. <laughs> he throws <laughs> it back out. That's why he couldn't find the ball. It was already on the field. Now he needs to hurry up the clock, and he does well, have a delay of game. I, do, I shouldn't bother Robin. That'll back him up five. And it might be, nope, here comes the ball. That's the one they want it. You remember old Thomas and Taylor, they, that's a job being a ball boy Thomas on the sideline. Thomas Taylor had the balls <laughs> lined up though now. Toting them frozen water bottles. <coughs> yeah. Hey, 
getting them coolers ready before the game. That is a job. Come to Robbins, he'll kick it from Ooh, the 15. Good rush in there. Up and in, Tom. That's going to make it 40 to 14. to the sideline Panthers I don't have know. done a good job tonight man <clears throat> uh, the Panthers will be open next week and then man you're talking about a big week Go yeah, to Eric, there's, or Alan there's Eric Richardson Richardson yeah he was here from 04 to 09 or 010 and then he became the head coach down at Dixie Florida yep and man had a Went undefeated one season, second round of playoffs, never had a losing season, done a great job. And uh, Coach Tyson had a position this year, and Coach Richardson wanted Moved to come back. back to Homerville. He was tired of I being a head he, coach. I think he's in the process of buying a house. That's right. Great <clears> fellow, <throat> man. Kids love him. Man, it, we're going to still be here tomorrow. That's a long ball game. I don't know if y'all know any local scores or any other teams playing. Let me yeah, tell let know. Yeah, send a text message to me if you got my number. Put it on the the whatever it is, the live chat. So, man, that's all been special teams here. <laughs> we got What's tadpoles? Tadpole that tadpoles going to break dancing. <laughs> Coach Carroll's got to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What a night. Robbins will kick. It's kind of a pooch kick on that one. It'll drop down about the 25. Good blocking going on downfield. For Panthers cover. Decent. They'll start about their own 37-yard <coughs> line, it looks like. Well, Mr. George Bassinet said Irwin was up 42 to nothing. 42 to nothing. There's Late in the Wayne. third. Yep. David and Misty McQuig. Man, David, we appreciate him uh, doing a thing on Creek Box, sharing his experience with the Lord. And I seen Ken Bennett, his wife, Mr. Ken. All right, let's see what Hebron can do. Red formation. Colton's going to roll to the left. And there's a flag on the play. Let's see if it's holding here. Nope. Oh, roughing the passer, I guess, on the Panthers. That'll be a 15-yard penalty. <clears throat> Big Craig will come into the game. 99 for the Panthers. Man, that is a big penalty. That'll put the ball all the way across to 50 down to the Panther 48. Trying to figure out. Some people saying we're a few seconds behind, and some of them is dead on. I think on YouTube we might be dead on, but maybe maybe on the some of them is a few <laughs> seconds late. I don't know. All right, here comes Hebron. He'll hand it off. A little draw off tackle. Great run in there by number eight. And that is uh, Winston Gassett. Great run in there. there. Hebron's going no huddle to hurry it up. Down 40 to 14. Same play up the middle. He'll pick up another two, maybe three yards. Fixing to go under four minutes here in the third quarter. They break the huddle. <clears throat> They're driving back down the field. They have three turnovers tonight. He's going to throw a long pass across the field, and he'll overthrow. Almost the, hit Tim. Did it? Yep. He was trying to Tim get Tim was having to get out of the way. 
trying to get it to Moore, number six. That'll stop the clock. He brought them back in the spread now. Got four receivers. He dropped back. It's going to be a quarterback draw. The Panthers wrap him up behind the line. Good job by Colton. He will fight and pick up about three, maybe four more yards. It's going to be fourth and probably three here. Four down territory. They've got to go for it. We got a Panther injured on the play. Official timeout. Holding his knee. Maybe it's just a cramp. Trying to get a number on him, Tom. There's big Jonas coming out here, man. Jonas helps the Panthers. He keeps them cool. Gives them water. And nobody gets more excited than Jonas when the Panthers score. Going to get him up. That's big Craig. Maybe he just tweaked his ankle a little bit. And you can just see how big he is. He's 330 pounds. He's as big as all three of them that trying to get man. him off the field. Hi, folks, here we are, three minutes to go in the third quarter. Essentially with the, holding the 40 to 14 lead. Uh, third quarter has been very, very interesting the last two or three minutes. Clinch with two kickoff returns for a touchdown. And uh, Hebron Christian with a long pass, a long run, and now they're marching down the field again. So even though it's 40 to 14, it feels a lot closer than that. Back to y'all. All right, Boogie, we appreciate that. Keeping us updated. Maybe he can get something on Craig. Maybe he just twisted his ankle a little bit. Yep. Now we're looking. Coach is calling the play. Colton gets it. Fourth down. They need, to they need three yards. Looking, looking. He's going to hold it. He gets rid of Ooh, a good, good pass and catch. First down. Good job by Colton to get it out there. That's number five, Tom. That is, <clears throat> check my roster right here, Justin Peavy for the Lions. And this quarter field team. Ooh, Ooh, good, good hit, hit behind the line. Great defense in there by the Panthers. Trying to see what number that was made that lick. That was a hard lick. That's number 13. 14 to 40. Two Elijah Tiller. 30 seconds left. It's, man, it's, it's quarter till 10. Not even the fourth quarter yet. I think the quarters are averaging about 30 minutes apiece. I think so, too. Second and 10 now for the Lions. Colton with the snap. He's looking across the middle. Ooh. Oh! Darius Dorsey, that's, it was waiting on him oh to come boy. across the field. No flag. I think he hit him with his shoulder. Maybe he just knocked the wind out of him. Coach Tyson's getting all his players over there. They were trying to hit a slant across the middle, and Dorsey did a great job backing up at his linebacker position. Did what he was supposed to do, got in his hook zone. Coach Saturday's aggravated. He wanted a targeting call. But I think it was the right call. Dorsey yeah, didn't use his shoulder. He, he didn't to, use and, it. And he hit. A clinch player that knocked him. That's right. You know, it was, uh, I don't think it was on purpose. Mm. I don't have a number. I hope the kids all right. You know, I mean, that's just a hard, I mean, you got yeah. to make the tackle. Uh, the kid's trying to make a catch, and he's looking at the ball. Oh, it's a bad position to be in. And it wasn't head-to-head. -head. It, Dorsey leaned in with his shoulder. And I think that's what the referee's looking at. Well, Tom, we can take a break, Yeah, man. I guess we can. We don't. Don't look like I hope. Uh... Here we go.
Homerville Jewelers on East Dame Avenue is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. If you're looking for that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby, look no further. We also have a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches, and necklaces, and can perform jewelry repair. No need to shop out of town, we can supply all of your gift and jewelry needs. Let Vicki Young and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Well, thank you for tuning in to Creek Box tonight to watch the Clint's County Panthers play. You know, a lot of times we get caught up in wins and losses, but at the end of the day, it's all just a game. The only thing that matters in life is do you know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? The Bible says that whosoever calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. All right, Tom, we're back here at Donald Tyson Field. You can see they got the young man up. That's a good sign. Probably dazed a little bit. He's trying to get, I think it's number eight, Winston Gazet. Really don't know for sure. That's going to bring up a third down and nine, nope, 11 for the Lions. But what number eight, so let me correct that. Might have been number six. We'll find out. Tim will let us know. Lions needing a first down here to put some more points on the board, Tom. We're still fixing to go under two minutes here in the third. 14 to 40, the Panthers leading. What did you say the Irwin score was a while ago? Oh, yeah, man. I got 40 some. something to. Let's see. Lanier's well, losing 35 to 6. I think uh. Maybe Montgomery County. Tiff oh, trailing man. Warner Robins 14 to 10. Irwin was up 42 to 0 late in the third. Oh, that's going to be a first down for the Lions. We got pass interference on the Panthers. See what we got up here. No flag up in the box. He was just trying to throw a seam route down the middle. And just we'll announce it again right at the end of this quarter, but we're going to stop the stream at the end of the third quarter for a few seconds and start it back up. So y'all just stay tuned when you do that. We're going to try to maybe that'll let some of them having difficulty. Of yeah, not everybody. Everything. Some, yeah, some, some, some are, right. some not. And so we're just going to stop the stream and start it back up. So and but we're going to do that at yeah. the end of the third quarter. So we'll do that in two minutes or. And the rate this is going about 20 minutes. Yeah, but. nobody will miss anything. Yeah. Hand it off to number eight. Good defense in there by the Panthers. He made two miss. Good job in there for number six, and that is Marquavius Grady for the Panthers. And there's a little bit of jawing back and forth. Lions needing to score here, second and nine. They can get a first down, I think, at the one, Tom. Colton looking, looking. He's going to roll, looking, looking, run out of time. He throws it. Two Panthers were there. Greg, you got to drop that ground thing. Yeah, get, get out, out the, the way, way. Greg. <laughs> yeah. Greg's using it to <laughs> lean up on. He's going to give his post, though. He'd have fell down if he'd have yeah. dropped it. Falling dead on his face. Third and nine now, Tom. A minute and ten left to go in the third quarter. Colton looking. We got oh, a timeout time call. All right, we'll be back in 30 seconds. You're watching Backroad Sports on Creekbox TV. 
And then a Lockie Walker Jones. Walker Jones is proud to welcome a new addition to the Walker Jones family of dealerships. Announcing Walker Jones Nissan. Nissan, innovation that excites. And you should expect the same great service at the newest home of the lifetime warranty. Lifetime. Now more than ever, we've got it all. So why shop anywhere else? Walker Jones Automotive Superstore. Now on both sides of Memorial Drive in Waycross. Get the best deal from Walker Jones. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Winky's Southern Styles in Homerville is the go-to place for custom embroidery and vinyl transfer designs. Whether it's t-shirts, caps, or special Christmas items, Winky's will make it happen. Go by our location at 44 East Elna Street in Homerville and see Lenora for embroidery and vinyl transfer. Winky Southern Styles supports the Panthers in their quest for another state championship. Go Panthers! All right, Tom, we're back here. Colton uh, going to the end zone. Oh, touchdown. touchdown. Great job. I'll tell you what, he's throwed some pretty passes That's in there. That. All right, now y'all let us know if it's if it's caught back up yet or not we um cut the stream during commercial got it back going and maybe we're all on all in sync now big jonas 40 to 20. i'll tell you what hebron has they're not going to quit no no they're not you got to give them that they're going to win a few games this year pretty good football team Snap, put down, and straight through the uprights, Tom. All right, Alan, that's 21 to 40. We'll take a short break and be back after these messages. Jerry J's Hog and Bones in Homerville is the restaurant for any time of day, whether it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, or that special holiday meal. From pancakes to pulled pork and chicken salad to ribeye steak, Jerry J's Hog and Bones has the best food and service around. Oh, yeah, and don't forget our great catering service. Go Panthers! Homerville Feed and Seed can provide nearly all of your farming-related needs, including seed, corn, bulk fertilizer, herbicides, insecticides, and a large variety of other farm products. Evelie and Nick want to remind you that you do not have to shop out of town to find the lowest prices. Our prices are as low or lower than any of those out-of-town companies. Come by and let the friendly staff at Homerville Feed and Seed help you select the farm products you need at the lowest prices around. <laughs> All right, Tom, we're back here. Oh, man, it's been a long... I know Mr. Barry is tired. They got Golly. out here, him and Jimmy. We got to give Jimmy a shout Hello, out, man. Jimmy. They got out here at 8 o'clock this morning. <clears throat> uh, we appreciate Mr. Trent, Coach Trent, Letting Creek Box come in. Yeah. Man, it's about 30 degrees cooler where we park now. So, man, we're going to have to next break we get, we're going to have to talk a little bit about qualifying for the city. Of yeah, election. that's right. I meant yeah. to ask you that. Uh, that's coming up here shortly. Is well, it the qualifying's time? over with this week. Oh, is it over yeah. with? All right, got an onside kick. Look out. Better get, it's going to go out of bounds, so. I'm sure Coach Tyson will say, we'll take it. Let's take it right there. Yep. There's J.D. He's the team chaplain. But, you know, we had two two seats come open for qualifying this, you know, this year. And what Mr. seat? J.E. seat. Uh-huh. And um, Willie Hardy. And Mr. J. didn't run again. And Lynn Robbins qualified for J.E. seat. And um, qualified on a punt. Nobody else qualifies. It's just oh, Lynn, Lynn's, Lynn gets to go in and then um, – Carlos Whitley qualified against Mr. Willie. Oh, so they'll yep. they'll be they'll, in election. Yep, they'll I got be in you. election against each other. Now, how long? Mr. Willie had I asked him the other night. We had a meeting. 
He he got elected his first term in 1980. That's Man. the year I was born. Son. And um, and I don't. I think this is the first time he's had any opposition. Good lord. I don't think anybody's ever ran against him. And you can't ask um, for a nice fella, Mr. No, Willie. Mr. Willie's a great guy. Great guy. He is. Been there a long time. All right, here come the Panthers. Wing to the right. Moorhead will run off tackle. He'll pick up a couple of yards. He, um, one time we rode together to a meeting. He looked over at my speedometer. He says, you know, he said, one time I rode with your granddaddy to one of these meetings. <laughs> he said he was driving about as fast as you are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> And I can I can feel for Mr. Willie. Yep. You got to put some dark shades on and close your eyes when you ride with Tom. <laughs> but he um he's probably been on the city council probably in the top five in the state of Georgia. Longest uh, longest, you know, held a seat. And I see him all over town, yeah. you know. Yeah, he he's, gets he's along doing really a great well. job. Oh. Uh, now Tom, when will the election be on uh, You know, Alan, I don't even know when the election will be. Oh. Uh. Um, I get, I don't know, a couple months. Well, Jay just, uh, I, I think he just, he, man, he's, he's done a good job. He has he's done, what, what, he's been on two or three terms. Up um, there, I, I know at least two. What is that? Four years? Yeah. A term? Yep. Well, Tom, man, finally, right, the yeah. fourth third, quarter, third brother. Third quarter's over with, finna start the fourth quarter. Panthers are up forty to twenty-one. Um, ah, right, where's the support? I, mean, I got to call out the feed and see. Where was the one I have that wrote down? The feed out? and see. <laughs> Jerry, <laughs> Jerry J's hog and bones. These are our sponsors. And yep. look, folks, y'all seen them. Barry does a great job with the commercials. If if y'all would like to do an ad, if you'll get with me or Mr. Barry, man, we can hook you up. Yeah, I think there's a couple. I've got a text, Lily. My niece does some marketing for the hospital and man, good. Uh, the new doctor's office. So she's gonna try to maybe they'll do something next week. I'm gonna put some pressure on her. There you go. Just tell her to call Barry at nine one two five five zero five zero three nine. Yep. Uh, or get a hold of me or you, and we can hook them up. Daniel. Uh, we got Lutz Brown Pigler Manley, Winky, Dairy Queen and Popeyes, Lee Engineering, Homerville Feed and See. Mike's golf cart, Walker Jones, Nissan of Waycross. We appreciate Miss Ava <laughs> hooking us up with that. Camping World of Valosta, go over there and see Skyler, my daughter. She can hook you up. Lolita's uh, Snow Cone Shack, Homerville Jewelry, and Burt CPA. The election is November 5th. November the 5th. Man, yep. that ain't long. Be here before you know it. Ware County lost 19 to 7. 19 to 7. Who beat them? Uh, I don't know. Big run by the Panthers. It was third and five and right up the middle. I mean, some hard run. A good blocking up there by that Panther line. Trying to get a number. I'm sure that's Moorhead. Chad Robbins said the good news is we call it and they got 11, cent, 11 seconds to know whether they want to keep eating snacks or pay attention. That's right. And watch it, you know. <laughs> hey. Panthers trying, Coach Tyson's trying to chew up a little clock here. I'm sure he's ready to get this one put away and move on to the next one. Panthers in the wing to the right. Snap, we're gonna run the counter back to Walker. He cuts up, makes one miss. Almost broke it again. Good saving tackle in there by number 16 for Hebron and that is Alex Paulson. A save and tackle, or Walker would have been back in the end zone again. His first carry of the night went 85 yards, so he's well over 100 yards rushing. Tom, you said we had 170. I'd like to yeah. know how many special team yards. Yeah, we had. that's right. Well, I mean, I, two, returns, two returns for 170 100, yards. Yeah, at least. <laughs> so uh, you add them to the rushing. In the passing of the Panthers, we're well over 500, I'm sure. Snap straight up the middle. Darius Dorsey, he's going to lower his head and run in there. Number 35 will bring him down for the lines, and that is Chris Colderwood. Panthers on the move again. Down to the lines, 18-yard line, second and five. 
Man, the high school's got a dance tonight. Is it tonight? It gets over with at midnight. By the time everybody gets there, it's going to be time. To, they won't even have time to take pictures. I thought they usually did that on Saturday. <coughs> Some of them they, they do, I think. But I think. I'm not sure. I think maybe. Well, maybe they'll come. let them stay to one. No. <laughs> yeah, they're going to take pictures ahead. and let's go. Going to fake the counter and keep it to self and dives over one, Tom. Okay. That's an ESPN play watching great replay right here. This is the athletic ability of Moorhead right here. Watch this. He's going to get to the corner. Oh, do we didn't go that we far? I reckon we missed back. it. Man, he jumped him at about the five, and he got down to the two. Went out of bounds. Come the Panther line. Drake Brown and uh, Amari Hodges in there blocking. Great push by the offensive down. line. 71, Tyler Posley. <laughs> Great job yeah. and pushing and shoving in there. Trying to get some of them. Some of them big linemen named. I know Dozier's one of them in there. He's 57. I call him Tank. Tank Christian Tank. Stevens. Christian Stevens. They've done a good job tonight, Tom. And that's going to bring Robbins on. He's had one, one block yep. and uh, <clears throat> one with a bad snap. Every one he's touched with his pinky toe has went through the upright. So 46 to 21, Panthers lead now. He won't know. What are you doing? He ain't don't have enough. There's 10 out there, which you can play without 10. Here comes uh, oh, come on. one on late. That's 44. Just get somewhere and block somebody, son. Just get down and block. There you go. Let's Keyshawn go. comes on the field. Oh, and he hooked that one. And, man, all that has to do, Zach has to count them, make sure they're set. It gets him out of sync a little bit. Yep. All right, Alan. Well, we'll be back in 30 seconds. Since 1972, Popeyes has been serving up mouth-watering, delicious, hot, and mild fried chicken and chicken tenders from its Louisiana kitchen. You know about our great chicken, but have you tried our tasty seafood? All of our menu items come with a southern style all their own. On your way to or after the game, stop by Popeyes and remember we can handle all your special event catering needs. Conveniently located on Memorial Drive in Waycross, Popeyes puts a piece of Louisiana in every single meal. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. Camping World of Aldosta, located in Lake Park, is your one-stop destination for all your camping needs. Stop by to see your dreams of quality time with your family become a reality. Whether it's tailgating with your air-conditioned camper, taking a trip to the mountains or beach with your family, or driving your motorhome to a faraway destination, Camping World has it all. Let us put you and your family in a camper for as little as $99 per month. And remember, when you buy a camper from Camping World of Valdosta, you receive a free Elite Good Sam membership, roadside assistance, and travel assist for one year. Hi, right. welcome back to Creek Box. Right. There's Smokey leaning on the fence, my buddy from Fargo. Yep. I haven't seen him since baseball season. He don't Alan Daniel game. just got off the phone with somebody, said the reason it's slow right now is there's so many people tuned in and watching us messing with the feed. I think we got over 1,500 people tonight between Man. YouTube and and the Creek Box station on whatever it is, creekbox.com, whatever. But between all of them, there's over 1,500 people tuned in and watching all over the world. You know, Mr. Barry's oh, yeah. got a thing on his phone. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's people in the military. You remember last year? We had somebody from Russia That's watching. Right. They well, tune in every every week. Well, tonight we have Seattle. Somebody in Trump's campaign probably. Hawaii, <laughs> Seattle, yep. New Jersey. We got several up in New York, New yep. Jersey. That's right. I'm kidding about the Trump thing, but I am <laughs> yeah. serious about everything. Hey. Yet. But we did have somebody uh, tuning in last year from Russia. Every week there was somebody right. from Russia tuning in. 
What do I reckon we were offsides, Tom? So they backed us up five yards. We'll re kick. Yeah, I think Zach was holding. He didn't do the kick last time. Zach was holding it. Oh, okay. Yep. All right. Zach with a kick. That one's going to come down about. It'll hit at 11 and roll, roll to the three. Out of bounds. Right. About the three yard line. And that'll be a penalty. Let's see if they're going to make the Panthers back up five and re-kick. Man, I've forgotten to. We got do to. that. We're going to Sylvester tomorrow. Ella's to in a beauty pageant. <coughs> Bless your heart, brother. I don't Man. miss them days. Woo, I used to have to pack up with Skyler. And then Lexi wasn't but in but one or two, and we had enough we of had that. We had enough of that. <laughs> yeah. Ella has a big time doing that. We, Man, she, me and right. her have as much fun getting – ready for them as we do the actual pageant got to go get nails done that's and hair right. done and, and dress she shopping she does a little bit of model i've seen her at yeah, the mall yeah or she something. does she does yep she does she got her daddy's looks man <laughs> <laughs> hey. 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 Well, that's, that's why they don't put me and you on camera that's right that's why, that's why we in the trailer <laughs> that's right <laughs> Yeah, that's bad to say Boogie's better looking than we are. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Big David brother. Johnson. <laughs> oh, James Christie. <laughs> Big David. There's uh, Brad. <laughs> He's pointing. Another penalty. Boy, this has been a long game, Tom. We started at 7.30. We're fixing to be three hours into some high school football here. Yeah. It's like a major league baseball game. All right, the lines are in a spread now, trying. Colton's done a great job tonight. Panthers bring a blitz. He's got to throw it away. It will get to the line of scrimmage. Be second and 10 now for the lines. Good rush in there by the Panthers. They're going to keep coaching to the last play. No huddle now. Spread well, formation, trips he, to the top. All the Heat Bronze fans are still here. They can't go nowhere. Right, they all rode that bus <laughs> yeah, together. Yeah. He's going to throw the fade Good. again downfield. Ooh. One trips and falls. It's another interception. Great coverage down there. One man misses. Look, if he gets in space, good block there. There he is. Another He's cut. Gone. Look out. He can bit the sideline almost. That's number 10, Perry Williams. Yep. He had a pick, 80-yard pick six in the first half. Yeah, he did. Number four knocked him out of bounds. Isn't number four the quarterback? Yeah, he done yep. a great job. Knocked you know. him out of bounds. A lot of, a lot of quarterbacks have quit when they throw a pick yeah. and walk to the sideline. Man, Colton has done a good job for the Lions tonight. Panthers will probably start getting in some of the young kids now, Tom. <clears throat> the ones that practice. Here comes big Gabriel Morris in the game. I think, let's see, 32. Yep, big Gabriel, his daddy's. Can't miss him. He's got that big orange hat on like a Big Lexus. orange hat on, yeah. Cedric's little boy comes in. I There's say little White Shane. Cat. Man, he's done a good job tonight. Doesn't even look like he, man, he's been running up and down that field all night. You do it better than I can. Number 18, Paxton Gilbert, then for the Panthers. Timeout, Hebron. Here we Can't go. Let's call another timeout. Left. I think they've called five apiece this half. <laughs> Coach Thompson's ah. saying, I'm ready for it to get over. Uh, maybe Brad will get us some more shot in the crowd. There's that. Uh, Alexis, he's getting ready to ease out the door. Yeah. It has been a long game, uh, you know, and you take away, Tom, we've had two out of pick six, an 85-yard runoff tackle, and two kick returns for touchdowns. That's yeah. 28 points. Yeah. 
That's the difference in the game. Yeah, it is. Uh, so when Hebron goes back, uh, you know, there's going to be a lot of improvement from tonight's game and next week's game. So uh, they're going to win several games this year. they got a good football team. They just get their special teams coached up, and uh, they'll get it together. Big 66 out there for the Panthers. Dalton Murray's done a great job snapping the ball tonight. <clears throat> Panthers would wing to the right. Yeah, we've got some young, new faces out there. We're going to run that sweep. Perry Williams is. He's trying to get outside, Brad. Get better out watch away, out. Brad. <laughs> he was running back. You can see him moving with the camera. That's our new shot, and we want to get down to the goal line so we can use that. Mm-hmm. Was there a flag on the play? What? No, nope, I don't think there was. The clock is running. 8.50 left to go. Roll on the clock. Tavian Saul's in. Number 18. Panthers wing to the right. We're going to run the counter back to Moten. Was it a delay of game, illegal procedure? It's getting sloppy now, Tom. And this is why it's added to the length of the game, the yeah, penalties. Yeah, all the penalties, man. I, I wonder how many yards, every, you know. I'm sure well over 100 yards get combined. Get out the way, get out the way. Coach Rance trying to get all some right. of the young people in. Second and 17 for the Panthers. Clock's running now. 8-12 to go. Fitting to be under eight minutes. Panthers break the huddle. They got a wing to the left. Overload to the left. That's where the Panthers are running. Williams, that big sweep. He'll cut back and pick up maybe two yards. He's tackled from behind. By number 51, man, and he's made several tackles tonight for the Lions. Pretty good linebacker, and that is uh, <clears throat> Jack Im. It's going to bring up third and 17 now. Yeah, we need to film some of the fans or something. Get us something to talk about. <laughs> And man, we appreciate everybody tuning in, man. We That's do. what makes this it fun. It does. When they text and give us, you know, a shout, let us know where you're watching at. Man, we've had people proposing to girlfriends, yeah. breaking up with boyfriends, <laughs> all right. kinds of stuff on Creek Box. You know, we got the Dooley yeah. County game coming up. Yes, uh, yes sir. That, the, it was Dooley County. Weeks. That's was, right. Yep. We got to go to Dooley. Yep. Fake the counter. Perry will keep. Good defense. Hard tackling there by number eight. Number 50 wrapped him up first. Number eight cleans him up. It's Michael Hilliard, number 50. And number eight is Winston Gazet. That's going to bring up a fourth down. Let's see if they run Jeremiah in here to throw him the ball. Nope. Coach Tyson's probably just wanting the clock to keep running. Yeah, just run it. Just run it. I don't know if Coach Dickerson's still here. Probably not. I'm Probably sure he's done. He's yeah. He slipped on out. For 30 years, he didn't get to leave early. <laughs> we'll run the counter to Moten back the other way. Good defense in there. and They'll stop him after a couple yards. So, Panthers will turn it over, Tom. You reckon he's got it pulled up on Creek Box on his phone? <laughs> yeah. He's either on Netflix right now and asleep. Yep. Coach Dixon still got one of those old flip phones, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah. You know, he had said all he was going to do when he retired was throw his phone away and go fishing. And let me tell you about the fishing. He has filled up a full-size <laughs> freezer. Miss Lareda told him he could not go fish. If they started eating fish today, they could not eat the, that's, that's, all the fish, all the fish in the fish freezer in, in one year. <laughs> that's how many fish is, and that's eating it every day. And he still goes fishing. Well, I have to go fishing. I need to call him. And, man, I've been fishing with Jim, you know, and late. You get home 11, 12 o'clock. 
A lot of times, you're like me. I'll say, man, I'm going to give them fish to red. Yeah. I don't clean them. <laughs> not with Jim. So he's going to go clean we'll them all. We'll stop yep. at Lake Vern coming from Florida. It'll be yep. 10 o'clock at night. We'll stop and clean fish. Now, does he go down there to the mines fishing? Yeah, yeah. He goes down there somewhere in Florida. I carried him down there one time with speck fishing. Oh, yeah. Uh, he tore my boat all two pieces. Mm. It was like a bull in a china shop. The old seat wouldn't fit man. just right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we had good. a big time though. Me and you went down there, man. We yeah. caught some specs. I think Jimmy's cleaning up out back, it sounded like. It scared me to death. I don't know what that was. 4621, Tom. Get this clock started back up. They ready to go home, yeah, bless their ready heart. To go home. <clears throat> I gotta go take my sugar medicine. That banana pudding's beginning to kick in. There's a pass play. They'll get it out to number 16 for Hebron, and that is Alex Paulson. Hurry up. Colton and them still fighting in there. Yeah. No huddle. Y'all get out. Come on now. Coach Winston saying, get off the field. They're going to snap it, hand it a big hole. He's going to bounce it outside. He's going to pick up eight, nine yards. Michael Walker on the tackle. Oh, we got a player down. He's right, going to get up. up. Nope. nope. Y'all come get him. I think he's, man, it's just been <coughs> so hot. These kids just. Getting the cramp up. They've been out there for a long time, Alan. Is Tim down there? Uh, let's see if Daniel, we can get Tim. And, of course, Tim's going to get with Coach Tyson, I'm sure, after the game. Y'all stick around. Nah, he's a. Uh, We're looking for Tim. We can't find him. There, there he is. is. Nope. That's Eric. All right, Tim. He's down there talking to Dennis Morgan. Dennis. Look at Brad. Tell, hey, him, Brad. Let's, tell him let's interview Harris. <laughs> yeah. Talk to Eric. Talk to Eric. Tell Brad to interview Harris. <laughs> Harris He's walking leave. off. Harris That's nope. right. He's going to leave. Hollywood Harris. Hey, man, we got the, uh, I'm watching the classic cartoon channel. You know, now the Jets and, <laughs> the classic cartoon yeah, because <laughs> the, the Thatcher, you know, I've put yeah, him in the high chair. Youngin, yeah. So, uh, I like to watch the Flintstones. The Flintstones, Fred, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And the Jetsons and Scooby-Doo, them back yeah. in my day. Uh, Those are the good cartoons. You know, Flintstones was nothing but like the Honeymooners for the cartoon. You know, I mean, it's just like the Honeymooners. Uh, Here we go. <laughs> it's a long game, Tom, and the clock keeps stopping, brother. It just keeps stopping. How old stature now? He's a year Man, old, isn't he? he will be a year old on Lexi's birthday, September the 8th. We got the big birthday party coming up. I didn't get invited. Man. I want to come to Thatcher's birthday party. It's on a Sunday out there at the Snow Cone Shack. Come on, at Lolita's. <laughs> you buying the Snow Cones there at Pops? We're going to have everything. Every Snow the Cone, man. Okay, all right. He's uh, <clears throat> I tell you, he's getting, he's almost walking. He's, he'll take two steps and squat down. He gets <laughs> scared. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> <Yeah>. get me. <laughs> <laughs> Got him any Georgia outfits yet? They're all Florida. So. No, man, I got him dolled up for football mm. season, man. We got Bless Florida Gator heart. gear from head to toe. There's big Johnny, the sideline crew's done a good job. Yeah, <laughs> Johnny's really <laughs> iffy and shops, man. Shops, it ain't long until deer season starts. Dove season comes in here in a week, I think. Yeah. And it doesn't go out this season. It stays in all the way to after Thanksgiving, really? I think. Some shops will get bit. And I, deer season I comes in. I can't hardly hit a bird. I can't see them. I just, my approach is I just, when I know one's up there, I just shoot enough. Right. Hope, hope he'll fly into this little you bit of like lead. Me. You shoot yeah. the blackbirds coming <laughs> yeah, over. Well, there's a right. hundred of them <laughs> in a group. I just shoot amongst <laughs> yeah. them. Yeah, just empty right. my gun in them. <laughs> 
I'll shoot a case of shells. <laughs> kill, kill two birds. Yeah. Spend a hundred dollars. <laughs> oh, he got look at Colt Come on. below his shoulder. Fighting out of bounds, man. man good he, hard he, running. Colton's a, he's a great quarterback. Man, he's down. not going to quit. No, nope, he's not. And Tom, great he's player. probably up to a couple hundred yards man, what passing. Doing, man? Gets out of bounds, it stops the clock. Nope, we crank it back up. Here they come. They're trying to drive. We're going to hand it off. He bounces it out, and the Panthers will stop him. Well, I was listening to y'all too. Given, I, I guess I'm supposed to be talking. They're yeah, talking about everybody needs to subscribe to the YouTube channel. I tried. Um, Creek Box. Just little Google Creek up Creek Box on YouTube. You'll find it. Hey, and man, if y'all subscribe, we can keep up with you. I was sitting here. Daniel has told me this over and over. There's number two, hard running Tom, down to about the 24 yard line. Let's see. Company. Man, you got to quit yawning. We want you to subscribe to our YouTube channel for notifications <laughs> regarding our live events. YouTube and Creekbox.net is where you will watch Creekbox this TV season. I have to pull it up. Daniel sent me that <laughs> in a text. Sent you a text right. on what to say. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, Alan didn't come up with that one on his own. He was reading it. That's exactly right. In case anybody was wondering. There goes Colton. He's going to oh. throw it out. Oh, wrong route by the receiver. He's supposed to run an out pattern there, Tom. Colton was hurry up get, getting rid of the ball. Mm-hmm. He run trying to make it look better on the scoreboard at 46 to 21. Man, I'm all tangled up in wires. Here we go. Let's take the snap. He's going to hand it off to number eight. Off tackle. He's fighting. Lean forward. He's going to pick up five, six yards, and that is Winston for the Lions. Man, it's going to be a late night. After this, I said, you know, they got to dance. And then after the dance, and they got to go to the Huddle House. Uh, and, oh, I mean, them kids, by the time they take a shower, Eric out. He's going to run around the end. He's going to pick up inside the 10 under two minutes now. Yeah, the, the, the dance is going to be over with by the time they get, especially the players. And don't they all take pictures at the yeah, same? Yeah, take pictures and. That's all they'll be able to do, probably. Thomas and Taylor's in eighth grade. We get so we got to drive them. I'm ready for them to be old enough to drive. <laughs> yeah. Then I was just going to go to bed. She was driving in the sixth grade. Yeah, yeah but bed. times are different now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's what you say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thomas and Taylor's not driving. There's the handoff off tackle. He's Winston up the middle. He's down. Did he get in? Boy, he's at the one yard line. Hard lick in there by Moat. Got to wrap up. Clock is still running. Nope. They've stopped it. I guess it was far. Here they go. They crank it up. Colton gets them lined up. You'll hand it back out to number eight, and he'll walk in the walk end zone. In. Panthers are getting a lot of subs in. That's going to make it 46 to 27. Minute left to go. I think the 108. That's right. We got our clock yeah, running. Yeah, our but clock's running, wrong. but it's really clock it's stopped. Stopped. That's right. 108 left to go. Alan thinks his mic's off. I turned it back on. Okay, so once the game's over, we're going to go right on the 10 then. Are you going to a commercial <laughs> or going right to 10? And then you'll come back to 10. All right, that's going to make the score 28 to 46. Hey, okay. you talking? Oh, you, I'm sitting there talking. You didn't turn talk. it off a minute ago. <laughs> yeah, I was talking to Daniel. <laughs> we got Tim coming up. So, y'all hang. After the game, Tim's going to interview some of the players and the coaches and all. 
me and Tom will be done after Tim talks. And we want to remind everybody we'll be back here, not this coming Friday, but Friday week. Okay. We go to Brooks right. County, and that ought to be a well of a game, yeah, Tom. Yeah, it should be. Always when you go to equipment, you better show <clears> up <throat> to play because they're going to bring that hammer. That bunch is ready to get on 75 and head north. Yes, they are. You know, last year about this time, we were probably in Macon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when, we, when we left. Oi. <laughs> All right, the Panthers going to return it here. You know, Hebron, you like to see a team they didn't lay down time. No, they didn't, Alan. And their quarterback's a great player. And if you're and coach Saturday, you, after the game, you're going to say, look, kids, we scored 28 points. Yeah. You take away the Panthers' big plays, and we win and, the game. Yeah, that's right. So, well, uh, that's something that you got to do from that side. And if you're Coach Tyson, you're going to say, hey, man, look, we, we come out, we took care of business, and everybody got to play. Yep. And that's what it's about, these kids that – don't get to start. They practice every day hard. They're going to be do an onside kick here, I'm sure, Tom, and that is Jack Redman, the kicker. Man, well, you can hang meat in this trailer yeah, right don't, now. Don't complain. Don't That's care. why you're yawning. It's, it's so cold outside. in here. It is, it is. <laughs> it's so cold God. in here that you can't stand God, Here we go. Here <laughs> we go. I'm cold. Somebody, <laughs> We need a blanket donated. Miss Lisa's, I got my blanket. I'm going to start bringing it again. Yeah, start she bringing me, your blanket. She got me a Snuggie, <laughs> so I got to get one of them snuggies. I promise you that will be posted. Oh, man. Bring you a Snuggie. Son, I've <laughs> stayed with you in the room, man. You turn the air conditioner on high and take the knob off. I don't know yeah. how you do that. <laughs> mm. I guess we got Man, gotta, when I was up in Michigan, I, I, it, was, it was like a heaven. What okay. what was it at night? Did it cool off at night? Down in the 60s, you know, low 60s. I was, and I was staying right on one of those lakes, and I just let the window up at night, let that wind blow. Man, it oh, was Oh, yeah, it was just great. like the beach, probably. Yeah, it was. Up to bear season over, over up north now, Tom? Uh, mostly it is. All right, we got a bunch of the younger Panthers in, trying to run out the clock here, and they'll take there a minute. There we in. go. Hebron's got to be out of timeout. I hope so. 36 will take a knee for the Panthers, and that will be Eddie Smith. 35's in the game. That is Demetrius Magby. Hey, on, let me admit, where's the sponsors at one more time? We got Jerry J's, Hog and Bones, Lutz Brown, Winkies, Dairy Queen and Popeyes, Lee Engineering, Homerville Feed and Seed. Mike's Golf Carts, Walker Jones, Nissan, Waycross, Camping World of Adosta, Lolita's, Homerville Jewelry, and BYRT, CPAs, Burps. Accountants, yep. All right, and you can follow no, Creek Box. No, just nope. right there, if you want to be a sponsor. Okay, if you want to be a sponsor, um, nobody's got their pen out. They're not remembering the number. Get in touch with Barry and or me or Alan. There you go. Um, if you do have a pen, Barry's number is 592 Five zero three nine. You can call Mr. Barry and get in touch with him. Like I said, or myself or Alan, any of us. Um, we'll get you in touch with Mr. Barry and love to have you advertising. Um, man, it's been great to be back, and Alan. Have, man. It's been a great game. Coach Tyson's first game. First uh, official, real official win. Official game. First official win. So yeah, you like to win the first one you ever coach, and you yeah, want to win the last little, one. You know that's going to be nice. And there's this little girl running out there to. Got there she goes. Cheerleading suit on. Yep. <laughs> Telling Daddy he did a good job. Yep. So All right, great, we got man. Tim right, ready. Got Tim. Tom, I enjoyed it, brother. We're gonna let Tim yeah, talk I did a while. Too, man, we'll see y'all in two weeks, right? That's right. We're gonna thanks everybody for tuning in. We're waiting on him. Come on, Boogie. Tell us what you got. One, two, four. All right, folks. It's a final. Panthers 46. Hebron Christian, 28. A wild game. Uh, first half was kind of uh, like a normal football game. The third quarter got kind of wild and woolly. It seemed like uh, both teams um, found some cracks, 
Had some big plays, a lot of excitement for the fans, uh, some great hairs for the coaches, but nevertheless, a good opening for the uh, Panthers. Got the offensive coordinator, Rance Morgan, talking with us here. Coach, pretty good, pretty good start. Your kids look good on offense, a lot of weapons. Yeah, I thought we played well. Uh, you know, we, we have some things we've got to work on, especially uh, with our pad height and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, first game of the year, I thought we, uh, we looked pretty good, you know. So I'm right. pleased. You had a new offensive line. Looked like they gelled pretty well. They handled up. They handled them up front. Uh, didn't see many false starts, bad snaps. Good thing, you know, early in the year, that's something you always got to work on. Yeah, pretty clean far as flags go. Again, we, you know, we blew a few assignments and, you know, got some plays confused at times. But that just happens early on in the season, especially with a young line. You know, we'll get better as the year goes along. So. You got several weapons. Uh, you, everybody knows about Moorhead, but Michael Walker was kind of a, a gem that people y'all know about. But a lot of folks may not have heard of. But boy, he's got some jets. Yeah, last year he, uh, you know, he averaged 10 yards of carries, uh, but he didn't get a ton of carries. He, had, he battled some injuries, but uh, we expect a big year out of him. We'd like to see him up around, you know, a thousand yards if we can get him there, you know. Uh, so hopefully him and Moorhead will be, you know, competing for the leading rushing spot. Well, you know, the good thing about him is he's a compliment because yeah, you can run that counter back with him and they can't load the wagon on Moorhead, so they both complement each other well. Uh, Darius Dorsey had a big, big night running the ball, blocking in the backfield. He's a load, you know, he's, he's been a three-year starter, I think. Yeah, he's a big guy. He, uh, he gives us tough yards in, in between the tackles and, uh, you know, he does the th little things right. You know, he gets out there with him as the lead blocker on a corner, he just he just destroys them usually, so. Right. Well, you got a week off to get healed up, then you got the gauntlet. You got Brooks, Dooley, and... The Packers and the Falcons and the Bears and seemed like everybody. That's right. That's right. Last I heard, Brooks and uh, Mitchell's in a shootout, so we got we got to get ready for that one. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to, you know, keep it rolling on offense and uh, our defense steps up and helps us out too. Well, one and is a good start. Can't win them all unless you win it, win the first one. That's right. That's right. Coach, you enjoyed it. Have a good night. Enjoy your weekend. Thank you, Coach. That's it. We're gonna wrap it up here. From Panther Field, Panthers start out 1-0. Hebron Christian's got a long ride back, but they got plenty of weapons. Uh, exciting. Uh, pe people in the concession stand probably liked it tonight because people had to hang around, get plenty to eat, plenty to drink. But we're going to call it a wrap for tonight. Remember, next week we do not play. We have a week off. Then the following week we'll be in Quitman, Georgia, taking on the Brooks County Trojans. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Y'all enjoy your weekend. God bless you. Good night. You're watching Backroad Sports on Creekbox TV.